Oh, I see. Okay. I'm like, where did it fucking go? So that's good. So we need down another uh, layer. I need to get down to the. <gasps> 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 Fucking kidding me. Oh, there's another one over here. It looks okay. I'm like, where the hell am I supposed to go? This place is completely walled in. Yes, that's good. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. Please, they take forever to respond to anything in the city. I'll call that Detective Camardi. I still have his card. He seemed really serious. Thank God I f Okay. Up. Oh, another one. We've got two. Fuck. Oh my God damn it. You son of a- Throw it at the box. Oh, wait a minute. I have a feeling I know where the key is. It's inside there already. We know this to be true. It's because it's right there. Yeah, see? I'm silly. Oh my fucking <laughs> god. I'm so glad you're here. You gotta have a balance at all sorts. The H oh. in Jesus H Christ stands for Hubus Tank because Jesus died for a reason and the reason is you. Why ban him? <laughs> no, don't actually. God damn it, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> you're awful. I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> oh... Oh, what's wrong with asshole? When it's mixed with burnt leather, it's not great. If it was just ass. You know, you'd eat that shit like an apple fritter. <laughs> God. Okay. Um... Okay, crouch under here. Fair enough. Fucking shit. 
I don't like that. I don't want to run. I'm running. <laughs> oh my god! Fine. Cool. You're running a track start. New dark and dark update looks lit. Yeah, Oodaloo. I want to play it again. I just don't know if I want to pay for it. Motherfucker, I will fuck you up. I will fuck you up. Mannequin. Goddamn mannequin! Hope all is well. I hope the bussy blast off is going well. <laughs> You must remarry at once. Turn to work as always. Hell yeah. Oh, now I can move it? It didn't let me do that before. Ooh. Looks like some sort of poisonous injection. I can't take that to defend myself if someone comes running at me. And what's up with the, uh... so weird oh shit oh god damn just so much to take in beating here. the shit out of his ball bag credits more pulse rounds let's go Brian <laughs> oh my god Welcome, uh, welcome in everybody to, to, uh, to Brian, the incomparable Brian Valak. <laughs> that can be hard when you leave a game for a bit and come back and need to find something. Yeah, it's not typical that I'm away for that long. I've... I was beating the shit out of his ball bag. Can I do this, the signs noises? 0802? Scrutinized on steroids? Yeah. What the fuck? Holy shit, dude. I didn't even see him at first. Wow. Damn. The game figures out exactly what you're doing. It's like, eh, eh. Bad. Yeah, I feel ya. We gotta determine... One, two, three, and a four. I think the yellow stars are making up one of the posters. <gasps> oh! Fuck! All right, I wasn't ready for that. You think you're so smart? I'm very smart. Oh! Is that the other shift? I can't run. It won't let me run. Hope you had a good stream. We're actually just wrapping up here as well. It's already one in the morning. Well, one in the morning Eastern, you know. Oh. Oh, nothing. <sighs> Excuse me. Um, we we're just going to find someone to raid. Gross hours. We're going to Tarkov do it for a bit after this? Perhaps. What up, everybody? How's it going? Hope you're all doing well. Um, today was a fucking day. 
Uh, but it's pre-Friday nonetheless, so we're just about there. Take my pants off. Brother. Right now? I mean, okay. <laughs> what do you think this is? Kick? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I appreciate the enthusiasm, though. pre come thirsty. <laughs> Oh my god, it can be? Oh, wow. It could be, but it ain't gonna be. Um, hope you're all doing swell. Um, I'm doing pretty good myself. And, uh, who's good? Oh, I was reading Rope's message so incorrectly. Wow, words got thrown into there from other sentences. Wow. Anywho, <laughs> this isn't Chatterbait? Nah, brother. <laughs> no, this is your OnlyFans page. No, if it was OnlyFans, it'd be just, it would be Jugs Juggies. It's nothing but man titties up in here. <laughs> um, so tonight is pre-Friday, or Thursday as some people call it. And uh, we do indie games on Thursdays. So uh, we got this one game. And uh, it may end up taking us two two editions of pre pre Friday indie streams. Uh, this is the Tartarus key, and uh, let me get the synopsis up because I didn't I didn't look a lot into the game. Like I remember looking at the trailer, and I was like, "Oh, cool!" Like I'm I'm gonna request a key for this, and I got it, and here we are. But uh, I feel like I looked a while ago. <laughs> but uh, it's it's got that like. Um, the uh the low low graphic um look to it like the old school look to it um almost like vhs fil i thought I'd, i shut the crt filter off that shit gives me uh all sorts of weird dizzy feelings so uh this one came out uh may 31st 2023 so just a, a few months ago uh it is from the vertical reach development group and the publishers are armor game studios uh the synopsis reads there's no way out for Alex Young, who wakes up to find herself locked in a strange mansion filled with puzzles, traps, and cameras following her every move. Whether she and her companions live or die and find the truth behind their abduction is up to you in this first-person mystery thriller. And uh, all reviews, very positive. How many total reviews? 69. Very nice. Shall we need to play party animals together? Uh, I've seen that that name floating around recently. I will have to check it out. Um, so we got that going on tonight. It's gonna take up the entire stream, I'm pretty sure. And probably into next stream, just based on some of the research I did on it. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Fry, for the nice. Thank you, Brian, for the hydrate. It'll be a nice community stream. Yeah, potentially. Uh, so, I have like one more thing left to do for Jugtober. Um, I have to make uh, a graphic. that I, I, and, uh, I'm gonna see if I can do it myself, which is gonna be scary. <laughs> but uh, I wanna, I'm gonna have that done by Saturday. Sorry. Anyways, so there's gonna be a graphic that comes out uh, either tomorrow night or Saturday before a stream. Uh, it will be in Discord. Um, it'll be announced on stream, and then later it'll be on Twitter at some point. Ooh. Um. What am I looking for here? Oh yes, the Discord link. Hello. If you're not in Discord, join us get those early updates it's worth it plus it's a lot of other mischief goes on in there yo res what's up how are you doing me when the ak stream comes on that's accurate i've seen it <laughs> hope you enjoy the game i hope i do too i'm looking forward to it um so i have finalized all of the incentives and milestones for jugtober for this year um so obviously we're bringing back the uh, the cosplay stream, and it's going to be a lot earlier on. So that way it's a, almost more like a guarantee that it'll happen. I think. Um, 
But uh, yeah, I'm I'm excited to unveil that. Um, but uh, maybe I'll post a hint up tomorrow in Discord. And and I hate to tell you, Fry, it's not the California race in. <laughs> um. So. I keep losing my train of thought. Yes. So, yeah, I'll be dropping all the information on Saturday regarding Jugtober. We have next week uh, of usual streams. I don't want to say usual. There's no usual stream here. Everything's outrageous. Uh, the week after that is the first week of October. We start Jugtober, and we go balls to the fucking wall all month. God damn it, Chuck. <laughs> and it's also not, um, it's not maintenance jack either. Uh, but that was really funny that Bird remembered that. Uh, but yeah, so everyone that's here, I uh, haven't given much love to Sour Not Sorry. I can't reach it. These jabrones right here. Good old Sour Not Sorry Brewing. Fantastic sour beer. My disappointment beer is immeasurable. And my day is ruined. Don't fucking do it. Don't fucking do it. Anyways, we got the chilling with my nomies. There it is right there. It's the uh, strawberry rhubarb pie sour. So, ooh, there it is. Love that crack. Fuck. <laughs> Cheers to you all and whoever's about to clip that. Oh, fucking magnificent. You never got the pumpkin or strawberry beer? The pumpkin beer, I think, is still there. I think it's still there. Oh, God, Wolfman's sleeving himself. Welcome in, dude. Thank you for the bits. Um, Fry, I think it's next week. End of next week, um, the butterscotch sour is going to be there. It's going to be fucking good. <clears throat> um, but yeah, let's see. I uh, We don't have to worry about any spins. That's a first in a while. Yes. Um, so, I'm ready to move forward with the Tartarus key. Check this game out. See how we go. Get the fuck. Sorry. Sorry, Brecky. <laughs> Appreciate it. How you doing, man? It is... What fucking time is it for you? Is it like 3.30 in the morning? What are you doing up? My word. Welcome in, though. Hope you're doing well. Oh, shit. I haven't set that up yet, Sleeve. Sorry. Fix yo shit? Damn. Ill? Damn it. Sorry to hear that. Jugs love is correct. Yeah, great. Awesome. Great. Fantastic. Okay. Well, <laughs> let's just let's just move forward, shall we? Christ. Yeah, I hope you get well soon, my dude. Burning up? Fuck. Tis the season, too. Just about that time everything shifts over and everyone starts getting colds left and right. I did say a toast to it, didn't I? <laughs> Thanks for keeping me honest, Rez. Okay. Uh, I already did all the options and shit, so we should be good. I, I think. I think. Uh, okay. Office. Yeah, this is as PS1 as you can get. Holy shit. You're gonna lurk? Oh, thank you so much, Rez. Take it easy, man. What? Where am I? I thank you for the lurk, Swizz. Uh, what, what's going on? My head is killing me. <laughs> She's looking like Popeye. <laughs> Oh, she didn't like that joke. Now she's sad. The last thing I remember, I was at home and 
I was eating some spinach. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, I, uh, wait. <laughs> yeah, she looks like Popeye. <laughs> Where am I? What is this place? Hello? Hello? Nobody's here. And now she's grumpy. Okay, okay, okay. Breathe, Alex. You can and will freak out later. What the fuck noise is that? My god, Marcy, it sounds like I sat on Noxler. <laughs> Jesus Christ. The work here is done. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, Marcy. I hope you I hope you're doing well. <coughs> Go ahead. <laughs> right now you have to find out what's there it is. <laughs> And there that is. Thank you, Demonic, for the bits. Thanks, Jeff, for the keyboard cat. I'll accept okay, Marcy. I think I'm okay right now, too. Except for this fucking keyboard cat. Anyways. Right now you have to find out what's going on. Hey, how does one join channel 13? Funny you should say that. Um, our dear fearless leader, Bre uh, Breakfast at Noon, is actually in chat. He's lurking around, not feeling too good. But um, if you go to the website that's popped up on the screen, um, that's not the website button. Piss fuck. All right, well, that's the YouTube channel. It's ch it should be channel13horror.com. There is a submit clips page. And um, you could submit clips through there, and that's how to get involved with the um, with the content, obviously. And then, uh, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> they make it quite easy. Um, okay, I actually dig the sensitivity for once out of the box. And drag with objects by pressing the E key, so it's E all the time. E E. Thank you, Demonic. Hello? Anyone there? So this is like Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> oh man, is this thing broken? You behind this? What? Hello? Is this a joke? Because I'm not laughing. And neither will you when I get out of here. Whoa, whoa, I just woke up here. We We're in the same boat, I think. Let's say I believe you. What's your story? Who are you? My name's Alex. You first. Who are you? Uh, I mean, we technically started this conversation, so we need to give some level of trust here. You know, if there was an application I had to fill out. Nope. Nothing like that. My name's Alex. My story is that I'm in an office, one I've never seen before. Last thing I remember, I was at home and I, I woke up, found this walkie-talkie, now we're talking. They're short-range radios. I don't care what they are. I'm this close to a full-blown freakout. Who are you? What is this? Okay, okay, Alex. Listen to me. I need you to take a second and breathe. Freaking out isn't going to help anyone. My name is Therese. I'm a PI. A uh, private investigator? No, a fucking penis injector. Yes, a private investigator. Stupid question. Thank you for the lurk, Marcy. Appreciate you. Uh, have fun grabbing those clips. Thank God. So you know what's going on, right? You, we can get out of here? I can see the pieces coming together. So in other words, you have no idea. It means I have some idea, all right? I was working a case for an anonymous client. Sounds like something out of a movie. Usually it is, but a stack of cash convinced me to at least give it a look. Eh, fair. Turns out, someone they knew had gone missing. Oh no. Figured it was the usual deal. Someone just deciding to walk away from their old life. Happens all the time, but it didn't add up. And I shared a lot of similarities with some old, co some old cold cases I pulled up. I thought I was just being paranoid, but it looks like there's something bigger going on. Putting that aside, all the speculation in the world won't matter if we can't get out of these rooms. You're trapped too? Looks like. 
Same deal as you, sounds like. A locked door and no apparent way out. Not the first time I've been in a situation like this. It's not your first time? Keep a cool head. Take a look around. There has to be a way out. See what you can find. I'll do the same. Okay, okay. Just stay in touch, okay? New information may lead to optional conversations. Q key. That was fast. You found something? No, I was just thinking about what you said. You said these weren't walkie-talkies, right? They're short-range radios. What's the difference? Saying walkie-talkie makes it sound like a child's toy. I mean... Okay, well, thank you, Detective Pedant. <laughs> Pedant. Pedant. <laughs> if they're the same thing, does that mean we have to be close to talk? It would depend on the strength of the signal, but you're right. If one of us can escape, they'll be able to help the other, hopefully. That's getting ahead of ourselves, though. First, we have to focus on the task at hand. Okay, message received. Um, over. <laughs> you don't have to say just because... Never mind. <laughs> Make it sure you stretch out those cream hamstrings. Okay, sorry. Um, but yeah. Flashlight out of the box. I'll take it. Short range radio out the gate. Awesome. Oh, I fucking back, dude. Okay. <sighs> this is the casual combine. It looks old fashioned. It seems like it's brand new. Hmm. England postcard. Pick up. Postcard from England. Edit to inventory. Uh, some objects have hidden details on the back. Press the E key to flip the object. I know it's unorthodox, but it's safer this way. I never had a chance to explain, but I promise I'll make sense. It'll make sense once I'm back. Until then, seven pillars, they're essential. Bass CW. Someone's underlined the word seven and noted seven, but what's the order? Hmm. Seven, eh? Ooh, book. Books. I think some of these are Latin, but that doesn't help me any. Yep. Door looks like the only way out. It's locked, though. I'm gonna need the key. There must be one around here somewhere, I hope. Jesus Christ. And postcard. Three days rooting through a library before stumbling upon anything remotely helpful. This is bigger than I possibly could have imagined. Take care of yourself. They're watching. Best. CW. So they say three on this one. That's interesting. Uh-huh. Looks like I'll need a key code. No point in trying to guess it. Oh, we don't know it yet, but... A horse head sculpture. Cool if you're into animal parts is decor, I guess. Or you like the Godfather, I suppose. Uh, okay, nothing else there. Jeez, what a mess. Whoa, these books look old. Like, I shouldn't even breathe on them old. Hmm, looks like a lot of Latin, some French. Even, is that Greek? Oh, wait, no, that was the wrong button. Wait. Here we go. I don't think I've ever seen so many books outside a library. It's gonna take forever to search through them all. If I'm right, you won't have to. They're likely just props. Props? Set dressing, trying to make this place look real. You you don't think this is a real mansion? I think it's a real mansion, just not one anyone has ever actually lived in. This place, it's almost theatrical. Combine that with the cameras. What, are you saying you think we're entertainment? I think so. But why? That's sick. I don't know, and I agree. For now, all we can do is keep pushing forward. Hmm. All these books. This candle's been burning down for a while. Okay. More books, lots of books. Nothing but books. Books, 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 okay. Oh. Drawer key. Alright. 
Hawaii postcard. Aloha. I'm inching closer day by day. We have much to discuss. I've attached four of my notebooks. I can trust no one else to keep them safe until I return. Best CW. So again, we now have seven. Wait, is it? Seven, three, and four. Right, okay. Seven, three, and four. Hell yeah, drinks. Empty, someone had a good time. Or a really, really bad time. Over the other side. Nothing. Yeah, I've got fits. Journal page. Added to inventory. A torn journal page. It's a scribbled travel itinerary that lists the order someone was planning to visit countries. There you go. England, Germany, Portugal, Japan, Philippines, Hawaii, and Alaska. So we have England, Japan, and Hawaii. We need the other four. And there's one right there. That's Alaska. I found it. The one that pieces it all together. People will call me mad, but they have to know the truth. I fear we've already passed the point of no return. This message will be my last for a while. Goodbye and thank you, CW. We've underlined the word one. Wonder why. Hmm. Well, we already know why at this point. Impossibly dark. Can't see much. Is that a forest in the distance? No roads, cars, or anything. Must be in the middle of nowhere. Ooh, ooh. You said you're locked in some sort of creepy room? I didn't say creepy, but yes. Looks like an old Victorian style bedroom. Hmm, Victorian? Yeah, I guess you could see my place looks like that. It's fancy and old anyway. Close enough. I can't see much outside my window, but it looks like we're in a big old house. The thing out there with the dark in the woods. It would have been too much to hope for a payphone. Would kill for a convenience store with a hot dog display. Hell yeah. Torres, are we really gonna get out of here? Start small. Start with getting out of the office. One thing at a time. I mean, I have a feeling that this dude is probably part of the problem. I just keep thinking, why am I here? Why me? You didn't give any reason you'd be kidnapped? What do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a courier, kinda? Kinda? Do you think of a more suspicious response? No, I mean, I just pick up whatever work I can, you know? Delivering packages is easy. It's just not like it's a proper job for me. Not something I care about. Well, maybe one of those packages meant something. Or went to someone who didn't want to leave any traces. Or maybe you saw something on a run. I mean, no, I don't think so. Look, it's just something I do to get by. I'm not involved in anything. Well, I highly doubt you're here for no reason. Think on it. Thanks. All right, let's check the ceiling. Look at the camera. Security camera? Wait, is it following me? Yeah, of course it is. Time on this ad was wild. Why were you kidnapped? Amazon music. Oh my god. Amazing. <laughs> so, does your creepy room also have a camera tracking your every move? Yes, first thing I noticed. Someone wanted to watch us. Fantastic, this keeps getting better. <laughs> I wonder how much these cost. Look like they belong in a museum. One of these is probably worth more than my grandma's house. But nothing in them though, huh? Hmm. I gotta find for where we would find more postcards. Bad. I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Candy. Candy twenty super fast. Candy twenty super fast. Candy twenty super fast. Candy twenty super fast. Candy, twenty super fast. Candy two zero S U P E R F A S T. <laughs> I like the spelling at the end. That was good. Andy, I hope you're doing fantastic. How are you? I'm uh I know. Why the spelling? You're okay? I'm doing okay. It wasn't a very good day, but I'm doing okay. I was looking for something. There are books all over the floor. 
Have they fallen from the bookshelf? No, it looks like someone was searching for something. Hmm, sounds like someone who was looking for something, sort of like you are. What does that mean for us? This place doesn't feel like a home, but there are still signs that someone was here before me. Scuff marks on the floor from the furniture being moved, for instance. More than just if you were setting the room up. I'm starting to think we're not the only people who have been in this situation. Jesus fucking Christ. Hello, Father. How are you? So, what? We're we're just the latest victims? No, and don't call yourself that. I refuse to be anyone's victim. We're getting out of here. We have to. Okay. I already did that. I already did that. It's all the same. I think we've. I think all this does the same shit. Yeah. We've already had that discussion. That's inner. So the safe is different compared to because this the journal page gave us six things. Sorry, seven. I can't count. Oh wait, is there? Can I flip it? Oh no, it's the same thing on both sides. Okay, so there needs to be another place where I can find It's like there has to be more postcards in here, right? Because otherwise there's only one door and it's locked Interesting there's no crouch, so it's not like there's anything hidden down in there that I can't grab. Be cool if I could move the books and like look around a bit closer. There's like nothing along the walls or the ceiling anywhere, right? I'm not. Nothing like. Up on the corners. Strung up somewhere. I don't see anything up there. Any more along the carpet I just haven't caught? Because there was one here. Huh. Sorry, you had a not so good day, drugs, but it's TJF. Yeah, exactly. It's pre Friday right now for us. Examine those books 30 fucking times. All right. Let's do it. For mycophilia, a form of zoophilia, oh, is God. the sexual interest in being crawled upon or nibbled by insects, such as ants, or other small creatures. This paraphilia often involves the application of insects to the genitals, what but the other fuck? areas of the body may also be the focus. The desired effect may be a tickling, stinging, or in the case of slugs, slimy sensation, or the infliction of psychological distress on another person. That's fucked. And it's... I, I, I let the dogs out before stream, and I hear this buzzing, like, up against the, like, the lamp part of my deck light. And I just see, like, this little black thing. I was like, oh, I'm like, it looks like it's a beetle. And I dipped my head under to look. I think it was a female cicada killer. I shit you not, so my hand, that fucking big. Let me get it, yeah. Pretty much the whole size of my palm. Fucking huge. I ran into the house so fucking fast. Did not want anything to do with that thing. Apparently it's a, it's a rarity when the females actually sting humans, but still, I didn't want to find out to be that I was an exception to the rule. So uh, I ran for my life and locked the door. <laughs> We've got four of them. We need three more. Oh, wait. I have... So, I... You know what? I bet you there's... The other ones are probably in that fucking safe. Seven, three... Four... Seven, three, four, one...
Let's go. Ooh. Into the next room. I've had a thought. Not sexy. <laughs> Fuck. Thanks for the bits. Ah? Huh? But how my room is empty. No puzzles, nothing locked, nothing out of place. Except for this radio. Okay. Why would they give us a way to talk to each other? Give me a way to help you? Because your only way out is me? You have to guide me to you? I'm where the puzzle? Precisely. Cool, no pressure. You made it out of the office. I know that together we could solve this. How? I didn't say that yet. I hope you're right. I never said that I left the room. Uh, Torres, there's no puzzles in your room and nothing's locked and you know I left the room without me saying it. Keep the office. What kind of person goes through the trouble of kidnapping someone? And designing elaborate puzzles for them to solve. Like, what's the point? In a case like this, I'd say ego. Someone clearly has a lot of time and influence. Possibly even money to do something like this elaborate. Ooh. People don't usually go to such dramatic lengths just to kill someone. Not when anything else will do. A knife, a gun, your bare hands, even your teeth. I get the extremely vivid picture. <laughs> well, point being, someone clearly has an objective here. I also think they're making a statement, you know, showing off. Hmm, what about these postcards? From the room you woke up in? What about them? I don't know, they're just weird. It sounds like someone was researching something. But uh, they also seem sort of paranoid. Maybe just set dressing, you know, theming. I mean, look at this place. It's dramatic in the extreme. I guess. We'll probably never know who CW was, huh? We should be worrying about ourselves before anyone else. I'm not fucking digging that at all. See what this one means. Two liquids, the duality of man. Maybe it's just two fancy potions. I don't know, I'm not an artist. The looks damaged on the right side. Like it's been torn purposefully? What the <laughs> Why can I not look specifically in that spot? Whatever. Restaurant's pinning with the lady who is absolutely over this crap. Honestly, same. <laughs> White bottle? Bottle filled with a white liquid. Um, where's everything else? And also, why does it have to be a white liquid? God damn it. An extravagant looking sofa. You'd be legally required to wear at least three petticoats to lounge on it. An absolutely ancient, ancient rotary phone. It doesn't work, of course. I didn't think it would be that easy. Hey, there's a phone here, but it's dead. Here, too. It's hollow on the inside. Just a prop designed to give you hope. You think they put that much thought into it? Alex, the cameras, the design of the rooms, the puzzles. Every part of this place feels designed with purpose. Even if that purpose is give some rich maniac their jollies. Where are the actors and somewhere there's an audience. Oh, that's creepy. I find I'm angrier than I am afraid. Getting there. <laughs> huh. Make my way over to you momentarily. Nothing there. Notebook. Humorism. The humoral theory or humor, humor, humoralism. Humoralism was a system of medicine detailing... The supposed makeup and workings of the human body adopted by ancient Greek and Roman physicians and philosophers. The four humors of Hippocratic medicine are black bile, yellow bile, phlegm, and blood. Each corresponds to one of the traditional four temperaments. Proper blending and balance of the four humors was known as Eucrasia. While science has since moved far past these ancient beliefs, rooted in a primitive misunderstanding of how the universe works, there are still those that believe there is a certain truth to these old teachings. After all, what truly makes up a man? Are we not all the sum of our parts? Are our bodies merely flesh and blood and meat? 
physician named Duncan McDougall theorized that the soul had physical weight, 21 grams, in fact. Does this not imply the soul itself could also be a substance present in the body? Something that could be seen, felt, perhaps even extracted? Such ideas seem flights of fancy, to be sure, but the possibilities are endless. Okay. Yellow bottle. Ah, so we need to find all four of these, uh... All four of the colors. Can't do anything with that. Okay. That's still life. Painting looks slightly torn on the left. Yeah, but I can't... There's a black bottle. Nice. Green bottle. Handle has been removed. I can't get it open. Interesting. Oops. The rest of the drawers have their handles. Yep. Odd. In that case, it's clearly the most important drawer. We've got to get it open. Sure, just have to work out how. Going off the last room, it'll be some puzzle. You were able to solve that one. Yeah, hopefully it is a puzzle, not just a home repair someone half-assed. Let's think positive. If there was ever a whole ass situation, it's this one. Nothing in that one. Nothing in that one. Okay. Let's play cabinet filled with knickknacks. Nothing jumps out as useful. Okay, I would have liked to have looked anyways, asshole. Documents. Which documents are the charts and equations? Nothing that looks like it'll get me out of here or like it might be a clue. Yeah, same thing. And then the red bottle. We've got all five of those now. Broken clock. The broken clock. Reminds me of a case I worked once. Back before I was a PI, I was a police officer. Oh, a real-life cop story. Ever heard of the infamous clock killer? I immediately filled with regret. Clocks kept turning up at crime scenes. There was death in the streets. Strangulation by pocket watch, crushings by giant ornamental clocks. Once we even found a victim impaled on a sundial. This is insane. How have I never heard about this? Especially the last one. I think that would be big news. I wouldn't blame you for missing it. It took us years to realize it was even the same person. The most punctual serial killer I've ever had the pleasure of putting behind bars. <laughs> you are a fountain of all the worst knowledge. <laughs> Still, I have a white vase, real art class 101 stuff. The canvas looks torn on the left and right side. Okay, and this is all different colors. Antique vase on a single rupee hidden inside. Ha <laughs> ha! Well played. Okay, so we looked at everything except for this door, which I'm sure it's locked. Another locked door. Great. I guess that means there's a key in here somewhere. Mm-hmm. So... This is yellow, and it's ripped to the right, but not to the left. Does that mean yellow goes first? And then, uh, where's the other one? Alright, so she didn't say anything, that one. Um, this one. This is red and green. And it looks slightly torn on the left. Maybe this You're goes red and green. Me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yellow's over to the right. Cynthia, what's up? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Red and green. And then the white one here is somewhere in the middle, I guess. We'll just put it here. This one goes here. Nothing happened. Very different order. Yep. This one will be the black one. This will be the white one. Hmm. So 
So the rip then is because it's all one giant picture, like I originally thought. So red and green is at the end. I overthought it. I had it right the first time. Red, green. All right, swap black and white. Oops. I'm confused. You know, keeping your knees hurting bad? Oh shit. Sorry to hear that. Looking like Zelda N64. Yeah. So. This one's ripped there. Yellow, white. Oh, you know what? Maybe blacks all the way at the end. God damn it. You good if there's one more fucking portrait here, but I can't fucking tell. Cause, yeah, because this to me, it's like, here's the beginning of the picture and it's ripped. And like... This kind of rips in the same area. It also could be this rip instead. So, okay. Put red there. We'll put green there. No. Let's swap these last two. on what the fuck nope portraits up here okay see any other portraits hung up it's just those three why is this so confusing and also <clears throat> what is this going to do if I put them on the right spots you know So confused now. Rips on that side means there's stuff on either side. So you would think white would be in the middle, right? And then this would go red, green, and then yellow starts and then it cuts over to the right. Yeah, and then this would be black right here. That's not how it's working. This is difficult. I'm just, I'm not, I'm not picking up what they're putting down, that's for sure. 
really is nothing that's helpful. I'm just not into these cameras. Seems like it's a high tech setup, must have cost a fortune. Seems like I should almost be flattered by the effort, almost. I would love to see the system they're working with. Uh, you know, if they weren't creepy, scary kidnappers. I wouldn't know what I was looking at. You handy with technology? I dabble, I like to mess around with computers. Pull apart scary systems in my free time. Oh, uh, nothing legal, I swear. It's just fun and, in and interesting. Uh, I mean,. Take it easy, it's not like I'm gonna arrest you. Besides, that could come in handy. Uh, glad I uh, know about that now. This one says, a renaissance painting with a lady who is absolutely over this crap. Honestly, same. There's nothing helpful there. I can't look at this one, or this one, or that one, or that one. Oh wait, is it the fucking... Are they gonna put the order of it in here? Was this the joke the whole time? Black, yellow, phlegm, and blood. The black, yellow, green, red. Black. Okay. Well, black, yellow, green, red. I guess it's like a mirror and they all equal this, I guess. Okay, I'll uh, just accept that and we'll move forward to the next room. <laughs> Alex, two creepy ass house, zero. Oh boy, that's not good. I made it out of the room. I'm in a hallway. Good, that's progress. I can see uh, there's a boarded up door covered in blood. We were bound to see some blood eventually. And that doesn't usually have a happy ending. The important thing is that it isn't our blood. Let's keep it that way. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I can hear something. I think it's your voice. You must be close. Unlock my door, try to follow the sound. Okay, I'm on it. Yo, Stroop, thanks for the lurk, my guy. Hey, can you hear me? Yes. Ah, finally, almost there. Just have to find a way to open the door. I'm gonna need you to hurry. Why the rush? You know, other than being kidnapped and trapped. I think I might have hit the door too hard. I've triggered some kind of trap. The room is now filling with gas. Oh my fucking god. What? Alright, don't panic. Gas is coming through slowly, but we've got some time. I'm gonna get you out. I'll find a way, I swear. I believe in you, Alex. Just keep a calm head. My life is in your hands. Okay, thanks. Oh, there's rest and dirty can barely anything. Make any features. Ugh. There's this toilet. Okay, you don't have to tell me everything you do. Why well, you know that's not what I'm doing. I'm gonna tell you that it's filled with blood. Funny. I've definitely seen worse public toilets. That's what I said. <laughs> oh god. Titanic paint fits perfect with the blood soaked bathroom. Whoever's behind this sure likes plants. Find another one? Yeah, in the bathroom. Maybe it's a clue. There's a plant in my room, too. I don't think so. Maybe our kidnapper just secretly like gardening. Damn it, you're right. What if they like gardening? We can't rule anything out. We just spend all our boundless time talking about it. Clack! Okay, okay, sorry. There's so much blood, it's everywhere. I've never seen this much blood before. It's making me feel sick. Especially you don't want to vomit. 
Not much worse smelling than blood and vomit. Gross. You can't say something like that. God, you lead the worst life. Actually, I don't need to know. Fine by me? I don't have the time for that shit. Reveals? Oh, it, it's it reveals? It reveals what reveals. I don't have time for this cryptic. What the? Wait. Bro, right, something weird's going on here. I mean, more weird. The reflection in the mirror isn't right. Isn't right? Yeah, it doesn't match up with uh, real life. The reflection doesn't? Alex, you're not making sense. Look, a painting just fell down in the mirror, but it's still hanging up behind me. Okay, you need to check out that painting on it. Apart from the subject matter, painting seems normal. Maybe there's something behind it. Yeah. Probably. Oh, the wallpaper's coming off here. Light's coming through a gap in the wooden I hear coughing. Torres, I made a found a way in. Just the time here is getting really thick. The wall was falling apart behind the painting. There's a space and light behind it. I think this would line up with your room. You might be onto something. There's a vent on this side, but it doesn't lead anywhere. How are you breaking through a wall? I'm trying to pry the planks, but they're more solid than they look. Oh, I can't think straight. Is there any you could use? Not that I can see. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. I don't know what to do. There's no way through, no way out. Alex, calm down. Polish. What's up, my dude? Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> Look, they're messing with your head. I need you to pull yourself together. The minute you give up is the minute I'm dead. Think. I'm trying, but... It's too much. I can't do anything. What the fuck? Oh, God. Alex, snap out of it. Stop feeling sorry for yourself and get me the hell out of here. I'm trying. What the fuck? What? What's happening? I'm... I mean, it's moving. Alex? Alex! What the fuck? Hell no. Absolutely not. No way. Alex? What happened? I heard a crash. Are you okay? This is insane. No, it's impossible. My reflection just moved on its own. It threw a damn axe at me. Through the mirror. You're what? Are you kidding? Uh, yeah, I'm kidding. Just a joke between friends in the old death house. There's a whole room back there. Oh, shit. Yeah, boy. Looks just like this bathroom. Yeah, it was a window, not an actual mirror. Cough, cough. Alex. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, it's Torres. There's the axe. I'll take any miracles I can get. I'm coming, Torres. Hold on. Damaged hatchet added. Okay. Part of the wall. Make a smash through using the hatchet. Hatchet would definitely be destroyed, though. It's risky. Not yet. Nothing but a broken mirror now. This is an identical looking room. No point climbing in, doesn't look like the window or door go anywhere. Okay. Could try breaking down the door. This hatch is pretty beat up, but I reckon it'll get me in. It's what I would do, saying that. In the door too hard is what triggered the gas. I could try looking for another way, but I've got to do something. It'll be fast this way, right? Fuck, I don't know. Actually, I better play it safe. Everything is a puzzle here. It won't be the reason you die. I won't be the reason you die. Good to hear. All right, we're gonna keep going. What up, door covered in blood? Yeah, I'm not going anywhere near that. Okay, so that's not the idea then.
block type shit. So I got a choice to make. Looks kind of like a dog's head. So it's a dog in a sandstorm. I'm sure it's a statement on the fleeting nature of something. That's clearly Satan. Nobody ever gets to criticize me on my taste in decor ever again. Of course, the painting of a giant eating a dude. And of course, it's bleeding onto the floor. I hate this place so much. Let's rush into the hallway. Was someone dragged through the door? I'm here for the clock. I've only ever seen them in the movies. It's broken. What a waste of money. You see a dead body stuffed into one of those ones. I beg your pardon? A grandfather clock. You know, tall, big pendulum. Not that, the dead body. Well, if you've got a small corpse, it's actually not a bad place to hide something. So it begins to stink anyway. You have led the most fascinating, horrible life. Your antlers. Could I use those as a weapon? And probably not in any practical, not humiliating way. Okay, no. No. No mirror source and I can barely see anything. I make up my own features, and I can't use it on that, huh? Okay. Got the plants. Window. He's getting his pitch black up there. No idea where we are. Shit. I don't know what to do, everybody. Handprint examine. Play handprint. Someone was leaning here. This one legal am I saying it's clearly a concern here <laughs> huh this is really interesting because this the cracked wall might work but like the door is also an option but again he knocked on it so hard it caused an issue what if that makes it worse Then again, is this just a fucking ploy to get me to use it? Because clearly someone had something to do with me in this room and threw it in that direction to tell me to go that way. So either it's a trap or it's a hint. And I don't know which one it's going to be. Wow, three ply. That's how you know these people are really rich. So yeah, so either use the hatchet here and it's going to be broken after. Or use the hatchet here and it'll probably be okay, but it could cause further issues inside there. Could. Doesn't mean it will, but it could. I have no idea. And there's not much I can really, there's nothing to read here. Like he knocked on it and the gas came out. We knock on it harder. Will it cause another? Will it cause for more guests to come out faster than he dies? Or we use it on the other wall. It doesn't work. The hatchet breaks, and I'm out of options, and I can't get him out anyways. I'm taking my chances on the door. Wait. Gas being pumped in much faster now. I think it's the solution they want. Don't 
Don't break down the door. All right. We have, it's, we have to do the other way now. There's no other way. Not, not bad. For a second, I thought my ticket had been pulled. Thank you. Hey, hi, no time for warm and fuzzy. Let's get out of here. We could just squeeze back through the hole and we'll... Uh-oh. What the hell? Ah, air. You never know how much you'll miss something until it's gone. You okay? I think I can't handle it. Good to finally meet you face to face. You have a lot to talk about, but I would like to get the hell out of here first. Second, I saw two doors, one at the end of the hall, and one that's boarded up covered in blood. Let's start with the one not covered in blood. Lead the way. Doing my best. We saved Torres. Hell yeah. Excuse me. Well, I do want to re I do want to take a look at everything in here. Tried the bed. No, I did not try the bed because of traps. Yes, but also because it looks filthy. I'd rather stand away, keeps the blood pumping. I just had these slacks dry cleaned. Fair enough. This is nice, right? The sofa, is that a serious question? Hey, give me a break. Most of my furniture is secondhand. I just moved up from milk crates after I graduated. Putting aside the death house factor, no, I think it's gaudy. <laughs> Fair enough. Try to fill the drawers. Look through this place, all the drawers. Every single one. They're all empty. Man, whoever's behind this just wanted to watch you try and fail. Fair enough. All the drawers to be sitting and used. That's how you know someone is rich. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, there's the the other side of the mirror. Is every page blank? Yes. Are you sure? Let me just... Hey, there's a diagram. Looks like a box with a sad-looking stick man in the middle. It's gonna be important. I drew that. Oh. And it's a neutral-looking stick man. <laughs> Get. How are these sadistic kidnappers able to keep a plan alive better than me? Ha ha ha. You doing okay? You're looking a little pale. I'm fine. Let's get out of here. Okay, you got it. I don't see anything else in here that's going to be helpful, so... What the fuck? The door's gone. Oh, wait, no. Sorry, I went the wrong way. Uh, that's the bloody door. Hey, that door is open. It definitely wasn't like that before. Okay, we move carefully. No telling what we'll find. Oh, fuck. That's not good. Where the hell are we? This place is way bigger than I expected. So some kind of central hall. We should head downstairs. Why there first? I found that most exits are on the ground floor. Oh, uh, well, yeah. That makes sense. Let's check it out. This is Latin. What am I saying? It's a big spooky mansion. Of course, the old books are all in Latin. Probably legally required. I'm not going to look too closely at this. One, it's very gross. I don't want to know if it's made with, you know. And for two, looking at it makes my head feel weird. I mean, are you really a creepy mansion if you don't have a creepy portrait of creepy old-timey children? 
Screw that, dude. Okay, we should head downstairs for a check for a way out. Feeling that's somewhere we can gather our thoughts. Right, sounds like a good idea. Wow, doesn't want me to open any doors, huh? Okay, we're going downstairs. Nobody really likes fireplaces. There's no making this place feel cozy. Huh. Over there, that room looks perfect. Perfect. Follow me, I'll explain. Maybe I don't want to, okay? This room looks safe. For the moment. Thank you, Detective Dismal. Perfect, cheerful, morale-boosting observation. Just being practical. <clears throat> I think we should rest for a second and review what we know. Then we'll be able to act accordingly. Okay. So to start, we've been individually kidnapped by an unknown assailant. Left trapped inside a house. This is clearly a person with both the means to craft elaborate, dangerous puzzles and a sick sense of humor. Lives are on the line, and I've got the burning lungs to prove it. So, that sounds bad. It is bad. We know next to nothing. We have no idea whether there's two of us. <sighs> you know, there's two of us in this mansion or 200. You think other people could have been kidnapped? The place is too big. And too many things don't add up for it to be just the two of us. Regardless, our goal is to escape. We should also attempt to find out who's behind this. Both to bring them to justice, if we to bring them to a firm punch in the gut. If we find anyone else, well, we'll do what we can to help. Like you did for me. Right, sounds like a plan. Let's go. I can't. What? That gas did a number on me. I still can't take a deep breath and I can barely move. I'm gonna I'm gonna down I'm getting down here felt oh, just getting down here felt like I was trying to run a marathon. Oh, Look, I know I'm asking up for a lot of you, but you're the one who rescued me. I believe in you. We've both got a radio so we can maintain contact. In the meantime, I'll poke around this room. Maybe I'll find information. Or another ass on a little puzzle, more like. At least I know who, who to call if that happens. You know, a movie splitting up is always a bad idea. This is a movie we shouldn't waste time. We don't have the luxury of making the best possible choice. Oh, this is so bogus. Yeah. I thought these days the kids said, oh, snap. Okay, you know what? You can critique my slang when we escape the murder mansion. Just promise to take care while I'm gone, okay? Worry about me, Alex. Just be careful. You don't know what's out there. It'll help if we have a map. It's not perfect, but I started drawing one. We enough to get you started. Are you kidding? This looks amazing. How'd you get such straight lines without a ruler? Keep track of rooms that you think have something left to do. That way, if you're ever lost, you can just check the map. Seriously, were you an architect in another life? This is so crisp. Alex, focus. I marked two doors and noticed we're open on our way down. As good a place as any to get started. Oh, and here's my pencil if you want to keep it up to date yourself. Right, got it. Thanks, Torres. Try and take it easy. I'll be back as soon as I can. Cool. Woke up here. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> There's one door we can get through in here. Oh, books in here, it looks like. In oh, well, that's going to be a fucking puzzle. A bunch of old statues covered in drop cloths. Kind of creepy, but also is new. That'll end up being a puzzle for sure. These are lilacs. My mom loved flowers. She used to tell me about them. I think these symbolize renewal. It's a lock from the lock. Of, from the look of things, it's sturdier than it seems. Someone else has already tried to break up before us. Guess there was no making it past the metal. Jesus. Oh, 
fuck is that? Okay, so one of these two doors. Oh, I think it's this one. Yep. One room at a time. Oh, this is the library. Look at the statue. Bust of a horse head, kind of angry looking. Do horses look angry? London Butcher. Records show a startling increase in the number of murderers murder murders during the 1727 London famine. During Mad with Starvation. It was in this environment that the London Butcher thrived. Famed for selling high quality meat at cut rate prices. It was years before anyone discovered their source, fresh corpses. Arsonist. Public faith in the police's ability to keep them safe was at an all-time low by 1964 due to the arsonist. Hundreds perished in a string of devastating apartment and office building fires. It's thought that the Dream Doctor massacres a few years prior served as an inspiration. However, as they were never caught, their motivations remain a mystery to this day. Okay. Okay, well, books fall all the time. By themselves in spooky old mansions. Or even kidnapped. I really hate this place. Block killer. Charged with 18 separate murders. What was believed to be an open and shut case ended up being anything but. Crucial evidence destroyed in a fire meant that the cl clock killer served a short sentence of only a single year before being released in the summer of 1988 for, quote, good behavior. Clock killer. We mentioned them before. It says here that they're free. Is that true? At least early for good behavior. How? According to this, he's a known murderer? Mass murderer. I was on the force then and we had it all. Extensive evidence, documents, murder weapons. Hell, even got him on video. So what happened? It was all destroyed. A few weeks before the trial, a fire took out half the police station. Nothing but ashes left behind. That can't have been, that can't have been a coincidence. I'm sure it wasn't. I headed up an investigation. Turns out our killer was a former cop. Well-liked. Friends in high places, you know the deal. Jesus. Orders came in telling me to stop investigating. I'm going to just focus on my 9 to 5 and let the higher-ups handle it. Did you? Hell no. But wouldn't you know it? I was suspended and put under investigation myself. Didn't take a detective to figure out my days there were numbered, so I quit. Best decision I ever made. Turns out my values and those of the station didn't align. What original. Biblical figure Cain, the original murderer, appears in various texts dating back millennia. Theories of Cain being the son of Satan and not Adam date back just as long. Okay. Weapon display. Oh, look at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Section on the psychology of murderers. There's one thing I don't want to get inside of. It's the mind of a killer. Not late night reading for when you've been stuck inside a murder house. Death Rider. The Death Rider is a highwayman of English legend dating back to the early 1500s. Wielding a spiked flail, they would wait by the roadside for unsuspecting passerby, passersby. Victims were beaten beyond recognition, many never identified, nothing was ever stolen, and their motive remains unknown to this day. Ferryman. Tales of a murderous ferryman date back to the 11th century BC. Considered a myth, it is said to have been inspired by Karen, the one who ferried souls to Hades through the river Styx. Weird, why would anyone be, bring, hang a black canvas, a placeholder, maybe? Dream Doctor. Forming a vi vivisection on a conscious human is near impossible due to the shock. However, the Dream Doctor was able to keep his victims conscious using a paralytic agent. She would then use a leucotome, a hammer, and pick for extensive brain testing. There are no known survivors. Jesus. Christoph H. H. Jefferson, the Crimson Artist, was active between 1290 and 1312. They would kill and artfully arrange the models' bodies, at which point he would paint the crime scenes in the victim's blood. Several pieces of their art have reportedly gone missing, and while never officially valued, they're rumored to be highly sought after in the fine art world. Lumberjack. The Lumberjack would invite couples to their holiday cabin in the woods. Overpowering his victims, he would force one of the couples to watch as he method methodically severed the limbs from their partner. He was eventually apprehended in the late 70s. Authorities were helped by multiple survivors being able to identify the makeup chainsaws used. Okay, so 
These are definitely the murder weapons. History of violence from beginning to end. Okay. So it depends on the year. And you go in the correct order. 1727. No, 1964. The original murder was Kane. But he didn't use these. There's no weapon mentioned here. Block killer. 88, so that's that good. Psychology wasn't one of the ones. Death Rider. 1500s. Berryman. 11th century BC. So, do we have like an ore or something here? No? Here, so. I guess you could get so London Butcher 1727. So that's 1964. Clock Killer is 1980. Only 1500s. So it's three of them that have dates. Four of them have dates. Fifth one does not. Okay. The 64, 1980s. Fifteen hundreds. Eleventh century. So this one is going to be second. Spiked flail. Is that a flail? <laughs> um. What in the world is that? Oh, the screaming frog again. Hi, Soma. Welcome in, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Uh, it's flail, okay. Butcher knife, flail, hammer and needle button, paintbrush, pocket watch. Oh, right. Dream Doctor. That's the connection. This is 64. So Dream Doctor is the same thing. Just hammer and pick. And that's the 60s. Hammer and pick is the 60s. Pocket watch is the 80s. What was the brush for? Death Rider is the flail. Butcher... 1700s. Where's the painting from? What if that's who our current person is? Hmm. Either way. The 1500s. What does it see? It doesn't see what this. Back to the. I was saying. This said to have been inspired by Karen, one who ferried souls to Hades through the river Styx. Unless that's. They're talking about. Um, that could be like. 
Crimson Artist. Oh, here we go. Durr. 12, 19, 13, 12. The Crimson Artist, 12, 90. Brush. Which was 1700s. 1500s was the highwayman, the flail, and the butcher, and that, and then this. Nice! There we go. Yeah, it's open now. I suppose I have to take these. Cool. Oh. Well, that's odd. Aha. Hey, Swizz, welcome back. Wait until year end stats so Candy can tell us how many times this super fast is used because I use it everywhere. Hell yeah. on how this works though why is it only three rows I guess we have to come back to it it's locked there's a note not taking unscheduled appointments okay sure everything else in this place operates on its own logic why not since none of the phones work and I have no way to call whoever that is for an appointment I guess I'll see if I can't find something that goes in that slot sounds good Where's marked the line emblem? It's locked tight. Okay. Locked tight. Why is that not updating that it's locked? The fuck? She's not looking so good. I'll give her a chance to catch her breath. Okay. Just mark the peacock elements locked tight. Go. Alex, where are you right now? Upstairs. It is, as you might expect, old and weird up here. Why? Do you need something? You weren't just outside the great room? No, why? I just thought I heard... N never mind. You seem pretty good so far. The puzzles are actually thought-provoking. I guess that gas just hit me harder than I thought. Are you okay? Did I come back? No, no, it's nothing, really. I just... I just when I heard you calling me. I thought I saw you two in the shadows outside the room. She says you had something to show me. Something I needed to see. Okay, not a fan of that. As far as I swear that wasn't me. I believe you. It's probably nothing. This whole situation in the gas must have done a number on me. Don't worry about it. But it's fine. Just forget it. I probably just dozed off or something. Just go back to what you were doing. But watch your back, Alex. Great. Okay. 
Okay. Master bedroom. Looks like trash. Slide added to inventory. That's interesting. Two middle squares look like they flip flop or something. If I see someone whose laundry habits are worse than mine, oof. Another one of those. One and three swap. In certain cultures, crystals have more meaning than pretty baubles to decorate your home with. It's believed that the many facets inside them could act as windows to other realms or even to the afterlife. One ritual involved building a doorway out of crystal during the fall equinox in the belief that the shadow it casts is actually a doorway to another world. Building such a structure is, of course, impractical at best, and it's unlikely that this ritual was ever really performed at a full scale. Which, perhaps, is a comfort given that if you open a door to somewhere, you never really know what might come through from the other side. True. Pizza break. Enjoy. Another one. One in four. Figure something out with that. We are looking bored. Is it for a game of some sort? Maybe the pieces are around here somewhere. Maybe I'll just... No, it's a bet. I don't want to insert the fucking slides. I want to... Oh, wait. One... Two, three. Oh, right there. Four. Okay. But what does that mean? Is that the, uh, I mean, it's, it's, I can see the, key, the keys that screen examine. Okay, I look through the, uh, uh, some sign machine on the wall. They were using it as a makeshift screen. Yep. Peacock emblem locked tight. And Lion Emblem, it's locked. I'm gonna find there's four things. Interesting. This always seems long. Shouldn't I be able to see the door by now? Okay, something is definitely not right here. Torres, hey Torres. I, I think I'm I'm kind of freaking out a little. I'm um I'm lost in the hall. I uh, I know that sounds, but I can't find my way out. Aha. Uh -huh. What? Are you all alone? I, I mean, there's nobody else here. Are you scared? Yes, I'm scared. What do you... Why does your voice sound so... Alex? Alex, 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 Alex. <laughs> what, Torres? Oh, boy.
What the fuck? Chatty, trigger many optional conversations. Alex? Hey, Alex, you there? Torres? Thank God. Hey, when I buzz you on this thing, you need to answer, okay? I hadn't heard from you, and I was worried. I mean, I thought, finish with me next time, damn it. We were just talking. When I was, when I couldn't, we just had an entire conversation, and you were being really freaking weird, too. What was that about? What are you talking about? I've been trying to, like, just a minute ago, I called you because I, I was lost, and you just laughed at me, and you were... I don't appreciate being teased right now, okay? Alex, we didn't. That didn't happen. What? No, but I, I talked to you. I know I did. At least I, I thought it was you. But you, I mean, they... Whoever I was talking to was acting really... Are you okay, Alex? Yeah, I just... I, yeah, I'm okay. I'm fine. I guess I must have... Um, never mind. Everything's fine. Look, I don't blame you for getting spooked. This whole place is strange. I wouldn't be surprised if these old walls cross some wires in that radio... Take it easy and watch your back. Fuck. I didn't know that door is locked. Heard that. Let me go down this side because I haven't yet. Locked, not getting in there. Locked, there's a curtain away and strange shapes in there. Okay. Locked. Oh yeah, this room. Okay, already handled that. Can't go into any of those rooms. Fuck. Hmm. Hello? I am not fucking like that. Still giving her a break, huh? Okay. There has to be four things that move. I have nothing here to help with that. So there's something I have to do swapping with. Question is, what am I swapping? They know what to swap and when to swap.
right. Trying to figure out where this puzzle would be where I have to move objects. Shuffle them around. Ah! Yo, Shannon, what is up, my friend? How are you? I have books and booze in them. Whatever the fuck that was. Like, clearly we have to enter in forward numbers, but... Hey, I'm good living. How are you? It's been a minute. Yeah, about the same. Just kind of doing my thing, you know? Getting all amped up for Jugtober in a couple weeks. So... What are the numbers that we have that we then switch around? Before numbers. It's not one, two, three, four. Jugtober. Ah, I'm so glad you asked. The Jugtober is every October. Um, it marks the uh, my stream anniversary when I started streaming at the end of October of 2020. Uh, both 2021 and 2022 to mark the anniversary as opposed to having like a big like me 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 thing even though it's called jugtober um all the money uh that's raised through the stream goes to charity goes to hope for the day which is a nonprofit that raises money for uh suicide prevention and awareness something that's uh near and dear to my heart and um uh, i'm sure a lot of other people in the community and uh, we have a blast i uh, i have a big list of like milestones as we raise like our total amount um and also individual incentives too love that frail that's a good cause hell yeah well make sure you come by if you can and we're definitely um so there is one of the milestones early on is going to be a uh jackbox party game um just slipping that out there a little tidbit uh but yeah that's gonna be early on so if you're around, come play. Been busy, but I'll definitely try to be there. Hell, oh yeah, I, I absolutely, I totally understand where you're coming from. You know, life is fucking crazy this time of year. I feel it. What is up with these fucking rugs on the wall? <sighs> Excuse me. What day are you doing it on? It's the entire month, actually. But um, Jackbox, I'm not too sure yet. Depends when we cross that milestone. Um, yeah, I'll be sure to let you know. Still can't talk? Okay. I'll definitely make it to summon you better. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. So there's six things here. Oh, wait. What happened to the fucking... Do I have to be in the room to see them? I do. Okay. Uh, you always play some interesting games. Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. This one is quite the uh, the mind bender. Every room is its own 
bit of puzzles and it's like it's really fucking difficult oh that's weird I know this camp was blank a second ago yeah a hammer and pick a clock and paintbrushes this has to be a part of the puzzle it is Hammer and pick, lock, and brush. But clearly, this is the clue for this, but. One, one, five, one, five, three. Oh, okay, there it is. I knew I was close. <laughs> nice. Oh, I see what room we're in now. Okay, pretty empty. Yeah, except for that. Wonder what those buttons do. Let's be careful with those. There's the great room over there. Stack of paintings, what are these doing here? Nothing. Nothing on that. What the yeah, see, that wasn't there before. Lamia painting. Well, this Lamia is menacing. I don't think I've ever seen them crawling across the floor like an actual snake before. Is it flying or falling? Either way, that demon looks pissed at the angel. Amidst the chaos, the angel stands. Incredible craftsmanship. A knight fighting off a minotaur. Is it defending the angel? Imagine a giant half-bull, half-man leaping towards you. That knight's shield better be sturdy. Huh. Someone loves buttons. Oh, turn those three on. Okay, so they all have to be lit up, I see. Got it. What the? What the what? What did it do? Oh, shit. Jesus, things have got to stop appearing out of nowhere. Everything all right, Alex? Just checking in. I'm looking at a bunch of weird statues and a painting. An angel, a demon, some sort of snake person. Oh, you mean a Lamia? Um, I, I don't know. Do I? It's Greek mythology. Lamia was a girl who was another casualty of Zeus and Hera's on and off again marital squabbles. These days, they are mostly just used as generic fantasy monsters in most media. The actual legend is much more tragic. Do most detectives know this much about Greek mythology? I can't have a hobby. Besides, when you spend all your time dealing with human monsters... Made up ones are a lot more palatable. I suppose. What is this here? Another podium. This one's covered in symbols. Uh huh. Lead circle uh -huh. on top. Jesus Christ. Anonymous. And...
Rebel cross ship. I'm a little nervous. He's only going to spring to life. And this is five things, not four like the other hints we had. Jesus. So this door won't open yet. What the fuck? Are we... Oh, I see. We have to put the right things to the... Who's my bobber? This is an angel. That's devil. This is the angel. Minotaur. Maybe that's a snake. A knight statue. I guess it makes sense for the knight to be the moon looking thing. And this is the demon. That. Hasn't really worked. Hmm. That's definitely a demon because like the horns on the top. Definitely angel because it has wings and the halo. There's three in the middle, it's like. I wish you knew what these things fucking like meant like as moon in circle, like there's something in the painting that is sad that tells you. It didn't tell me anything. <sighs> Excuse me. Hmm. Oh, maybe it's a key. Like this. That. Yeah, well, no, because then the second one is angel. But the second one's actually a demon. Then the third one is a demon, but it's actually an angel. Then the knight. That would be Minotaur. What do the buttons do? Um, they're not doing anything now. I already completed it. There were yellow buttons before. 
I have to slide these dials just determining So maybe Lamia is twenty okay, the twenty seven thingy. And then this says that this devil number two is that. In the middle would be the angel. Angels over here. Given what looks like. The devil was once an angel. That is true. Yeah, we got it. It's a convoluted lock system, but at least those doors across the hall are open. I hope there's something nice inside. I mean, probably not, but I hope. Cool. Dude, that was the Minotaur. Dude, that was for the snake person. Dude, that was night. Yeah, we end up just doing the swap. All right, cool. Fuck was that noise? Oh, God. Uh, yes, hello. I am, as you might imagine, quite relieved to see you. Oh, uh, that's not good. You, are you okay? What is this? Okay, my young friend, I am ecstatic. Or wouldn't I be? Tangible proof of my life's work. I, I, I am actually quite moved by it all, as the kids say. This is all of that in a bag of chips. I don't think they do say that, and your tangible proof is tangibly throttling you. Ah, uh, my apologies, I was quite carried away in the excitement. My name is Charles Warner. I'm a historian in a specialized field of study. Not long ago, I woke up to find myself as you see me now. This has got to be special effects, right? The old practical stuff? Uh, I'm going to get you out of there. I'll pull. I would advise against force. Whenever I struggle, it seems to upset it. And how do I get you out of here? That's the spirit. Into the unknown with open arms. Granted, I don't have any, uh... Hands on experience with this scenario. But if you were to look at your feet, that symbol isn't complete, but it shares similarities with uh, vanishing circles prevalent in other cultures' mythos. If you could find a way to complete it, then perhaps. Sure, fine, why not, whatever. What my boundless knowledge of ancient mythological ceremonies, it'll be a cinch. Are you all right? Not even close, what else is due tonight? And please have a look around. If you find something, bring it to me and I may be able to help. All right. A ragged book looks to be jolly telling someone's travels. Mystic land, strange animals, and beasts. Fiction, obviously, right? Vanishing book added to inventory. What does it say? I can't tell if it's a fairy tale or meant to be serious. It's some sort of travel log, but all of the things it describes, well, they don't exist. Strange places, monsters. Monsters or demons? Uh, trust me, it's a very important distinction. There's always some truth in any piece of fiction. Keep it in mind. All right, I began my journey in the east. The barrier between our worlds rendered useless by great glowing gates. In my west lay a city of great spires, staggering tall and blindingly white. How long did I stay? Even now I cannot say. My time in the southern wastes was all too brief. 
chased by a crimson crow. Emanating an unbearable heat, I had to flee. I would have wandered into the frozen north if not for the reptiles keeping guard. Though unintentional, I only live and breathe today thanks to them. No spin 12. Alright, so that's how to do that, but I gotta find all the items. What is this? It's moving, it's alive. Oh, I'm not touching it. Soma! God damn it. That's two fucking spins. Thank you for the gifted subs. One for Meg, one for Marcy, and one for Satan herself. Sick. Thank you, Soma. Yeah, you know what? I think a nice, uh, a good break right here is not a bad idea. Let me get through this dialogue. Alive, an interesting thought. I would describe a counterfield as alive. Once it's a steak on your plate, it's considered dead. I don't like where this is going. What if that steak started moving? Is it alive again? Please don't take this the wrong way, Charles, but stop talking to me. <laughs> this one, simple enough, looks like a diamond. What's this? Looks like a sigil you might need it to complete the circle. So how do I, uh, you're the demon expert. Go over here and describe it to me. I might be able to identify it for you. Let me identify it for him first. Yeah, that's what you got. Diablo, this is the sigil of the demon Furfur, an enormous deer creature. Its mighty hooves would shatter the sky, leaving thunderstorms in its wake. And that's everything for now. I get the feeling that there's more sigils. Try to find them all. So that finishes drawing, you'll be free. This is the core component. Yes, I guide you through the rest of the ritual. Mm, well, I guess I'll have to figure out where to put each sigil then. That's where I can be of some assistance. I dare say all my studies have led to this. Bring me anything that you don't understand, and I'll do my best to identify it for you. Okay. That's we'll take a quick little break. Uh, all right. Do a little spinny spin. Damn it, I'm so for whiskey. Uh damn it. Uh Maruga Scorpion Pepper coming right up. <laughs> Elmo Fire, yeah. What's up, Twy? Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. There it is. Okay. Uh, okay, super sleepy today. Yeah, I was a little sleepy earlier too. Oh. Yeah, demonic. So this is the garlic moruga uh, hot sauce from the Gonzo Sauce Group. The age old tradition of Soma causing chaos and general mischief. Yeah. So this is rated at very hot, three out of three. One of the hottest hot sauces on the wheel, because of course it is. It's got garlic, moruga scorpion mash, avocado oil, white wine vinegar, water, fresh lime juice and zest, toasted mustard seeds, and spices. The sauce sounds great, I love garlic. Yeah, well, garlic is very good. I love it. But Maruga scorpion peppers are, are not as nice. But either way, cheers. Oh, instantaneously. 
Holy shit. Oh. Let's take three away from that wheel. Counter. Oh. Holy shit. <clears throat> oh my god. Uh it's just consistent fucking heat and pain, this one. But I showed up at a great time. Hi, stranger. Well, hello, madam. How are you? Yep, just having some, um, some hot sauce. <laughs> How have you been? Your brain just, yeah. Wow, fuck. Oh, alive? Yeah, same. About the same. Let's, uh, you know what? I feel chaotic as well, Soma, so let's spin it one more time. Your throat hurts watching me? <laughs> Just wait. There's more coming. Terrible idea. Oh, I almost had double Maruga. That would have sucked. All right, Plum Dog Millionaire. There it is. There is blood on the ground. Okay. This one isn't as hot, I can tell you that. But this one is the Plum Dog Millionaire, also from Gonzo. Whew. It is rated two out of three between medium and hot. And uh, it's got Kangstar, Kangstar White Thai chilies, red jalapeno chilies, fresh plums, carrots, ginger, molasses, and cinnamon. I do like this one, but it's it's got some heat to it. Oh. Cheers. Oh. Yeah, see, the Maruga is still there. So all this does, it doesn't mask it, it just compounds on top of itself. Oh my god. Oh. <sighs> Whew, yeah, dying indeed. All right, we're gonna reset the counter. Oh, I did it. I deserve this. <clears throat> we destroyed my inner GI tract. Oh, God. Oh. Thank you, Twy. I love how I haven't seen you in a hot minute and I'm watching you suffer. That's kind of how it works. <laughs> <sighs> if I don't feel pain, then am I really living? I'm not fucking sorry. No, 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 no. Mood. Yeah. Oh, holy shit. Ah. Uh. Fucking lips are on fire. Oh, I could have called the reinforcements. Chapstick. How well that works, we'll find out. Oh. Uh. 
Okay. I'm gonna try to get back into the game so I don't think about how much my mouth is on fire. Uh, uh, uh. Hope that's cool with you all. <sighs> wow. I had never sa saved it. That would have been bad. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so we got to oh it tells me the uh, The direction okay, so north is facing him. All right, cool All right. I think S spires might be the one Crimson crow Reptiles to the north. I think this one, the deer one. Oh, that's like, this is basically supposed to be like a deer. West. Okay. Oh, all right. We got to find more sigils. Already found that one. Oh, I think there's a sigil here. Just got to move the painting. It looks like a weird robot. All right, let's go talk to our bud. Oh. Welcome back, Marcy. Yeah, someone wanted to see me in pain. <laughs> so they uh, give to me three subs. Oh. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's see what you got. Oh, yes, I recognize this. It's the sigil of the demon Malthus. It takes the form of a giant stork. An artisan. It would build high towers and strongholds of the toughest materials. And that's everything for now. You have a feeling that there's more sigils. Try to find them all. So that could be the crow, but what's this? It's like a mountain. Let's see what you got. This would be the sigil of Rom, a crow demon known to steal, always seeking treasure. Most famous heist was that of the underworld soul flame, leaving it permanently shrouded in a fire that will never go out. That's everything for now. I get the feeling that there's more sigils. Try to find them all. All right, so there's one more. So I got that one. We've got the, this one here, that one there. There's gonna be one over here. Some oh, right there. And these books. Move the books. Shield. What do we got, pal? Let's see what you got. Yes, this is the sigil for the demon Andromalus. Serpent tasked with discovering and punishing the evils of the spirit world. And that's everything for now. I get the feeling that there's more sigils. Try to find them all. No, that's all four. Thank you, Tree. Welcome in, bud. <laughs> Candy Marsh and I are still trying to convince a sweatpants stream for sci- Yeah, for science. Okay, perverts. <laughs> Girl, lock behind me. I'll deal with it after. Charles is free. Uh, Okay. Not much else I can really do here. There are no more sigils. <laughs> Said you're an expert on demons? Well, more likely, I'm a historian. Some peers consider me famous and others uh, infamous or eccentric. I've been acting for uncovering stories through the lost, connecting the dots are looked by those seeking a more obvious truth. Uh, and the demons? Demonology is one of my more unusual research areas. My academic peers do not approve. They feel it's childish, sadly, if they only they could see. <laughs> Oh, shit, huh? All right, so let's take a look here. Began by during the East, the barrier between our worlds was rendered useless by great glowing gates. There's, there's your gates. That's the East. Soma. 
Um, all right, so which one south was too brief chased by a crimson crow? South. South is Rom, this one. Crow, yep, okay. North, south. Uh, excuse me. And the last one is the serpent. The Andromalius, a serpent that was tasked with discovering and punishing the evils of the spirit world. I, uh, I would have wandered into the frozen north if not for the reptiles keeping guard, though unintentionally. I only live and breathe today thanks to them. So yeah, that's definitely it. Because serpent is a reptile, yeah? Last I checked. I should do it. I hope. Circle's looking good from here. Do you got all the sigils in the right place? Yes. I think we're ready. Let's do this. I'm most certain about three of them, so as that could possibly be. Yeah, hopefully this works. Now you've probably prepared, you only have one more step to complete. You have to visualize sending the creature back, banishing it into the void. Uh yeah, I'll just think about that. Going so it'll happen. Oh Jesus. Wait. Is this meant to happen? No. I fucked up. Uh, someone was in there. They're gone now. Where did they go? Uh, da, da, da. Da, 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 I want to get through this because I'm going to load. Would have had more tracks with sweatpants, just saying. True. Failed to save Charles. Oh, God. And then gives me a lion key. What happened? Oh, Charles, I'm here to save you, pal. Okay, and then the last one was here, I think. Yes, yeah, so we've all four. <sighs> we got all the sigils lined up. Bah, 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 bah. Okay, so my time in the southern waste was all too brief. Chased by a crimson crow. Well, let's start with the other side first, right? Begin my journey in the east. The barrier between our worlds rendered useless by great glowing gates. Giant stork took care of construction and seemed to really love metal. Serpent has dis discovering and punishing the evils of the spirit world. Shadow the sky leaving thunderstorms in its wake. Proton to steel always seeking treasure. Its most famous heist was that of the underworld soul flame permanently shredding it into fire that will never go out. We've had more traction with Swap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I fucking read that. If you begin your journey in the east, it's gonna be. It's the gates. It's it's this. Construction. Seem to really love metal. This isn't gates. Thunderstorm, sky. Punishing evils of the spirit world. And. Routing in fire. Yeah, so east. Oh, it's time, baby. Scaredy. Fairly certain. Hello, my friend. That Britney Home Alone is not a scary game. Oh, no. Britney's home alone with her toys, and she needs someone to take care of her. Uh, Scaredy, what, what kind of games are you playing? <laughs> My word. <laughs> S 
Scaredy's, uh... Let me home alone. Sounds like my kind of game. That's, uh... A little interesting. You know, it's your stream. You do what you want with it. <laughs> so we don't have a game and it took me to a different kind of game. I, I think it was the exact game you were looking for. <laughs> Oh my god. Welcome in, Scaredy. Hope you're doing well. How, tell me about your stream. What were you playing? What were you guys up to? Um, hope it was a good one. Uh, for everyone that came over in the raid, if you don't know me, I'm Jug. It's, you know, for short. It's all easy, a lot easier than the Juggernaut 6, 7, 8, 9. Unless you really want to go for it. Like, go for it. But, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I, I'm a horror streamer pretty much 98 to 99 percent of the time sprinkling some goodness here and there that isn't horror um if you uh if you're inter interested in seeing the teams i work with uh, of other fellow horror streamers go ahead and check chat you'll find the ceos of screams link uh which is a twitch stream team that i joined back in july and then of course channel 13 horror uh, which were on YouTube, and uh, if you enjoy jump scare compilation videos, that is the place to go. Subscribe to them. Please, please, please subscribe to them. Brand new episodes coming out October 1st, so make sure you are around for it. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much my spiel. That's what I'm here for, and then we uh, we, we drink some hot sauces, eat some other spicy foods, and, uh, and Jugtober's coming up. We're going to raise money for charity next month. Um, and... Uh, we are trying to build to a thousand followers. We're at 949 right now, according to my numbers over here. And uh, so we're 51 away. Uh, so if you're not following, and you enjoy the content, highly recommend you hit that heart button or follow button, whether you're on mobile or desktop. And uh, you'll know you'll know when we go live again, which is typically Monday, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Uh, and once we reach a thousand followers, I have to do a 24 hour stream. It's going to be absolutely fucking mayhem. You played the Isle Tide Hotel and loved it. It's new from Wales Interactive. I've not heard of that game. Instead of a coconut bra, can you do a pumpkin bra redeem? Oh my word. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I gotta look at this again. So this is our gate one. So we're, we're, by the way, we're playing the Tartarus key. We like woke up in this house and we're trying to save people in it. And there's a lot of weird shit going on. It's a lot of puzzles. It's been, it's a mystery thriller. Um, perfect for Juggies Jugs. Yeah, Jugs Juggies. Uh -uh. <laughs> so east is the gate one. So east. And that's the gates. Construction seemed to really love metal. All right. To my west lay a city of great spires. Staggering tall and blindly white. How long did I stay? Even now I cannot say. What are spires? Did I already fuck this up? Maybe I misunderstood the term spires. Is it towers? Fuck. A slender tapering blade or stalk as of grass? That nah, can't be it. Spires give a building a sense of vertical lift looking upward towards the heavens. Tall point of structure on top of a building, especially on top of a church tower. Give of a spire. Yeah, it's like really tall. Fuck, it could be that one too. Hold on, can we change? We can change, okay. Not sure I could use this. Uh, well, let's put the same one here. All right. And then again, east, the barrier between our worlds rendered useless by great glowing gates. This one was a serpent who was tasked with discovering and punishing the evils of the spirit world. 
giant deer, its mighty hooves would shatter the sky, leaving thunderstorms in its wake. And then the crow, most famous heist is of the underworld soul flame. See, I don't... What if these are both the same symbol? Is that possible? Maybe it is. A time in the southern waste was all too brief, chased by a crimson crow. Emanating an unbearable heat, I had to flee. Yeah, see, that's the crow and the it's the, the, the crow light and the fire and all that. Um, and that is Yeah, Rom, a crow known to steal, always seeking treasure. Its most famous heist was that of the underworld soul flame permanently shrouding in, in a fire that will never go out. Yo, Wheeler, what's up, dude? How you doing? This is south, so I would put this... Rom would go in the south. And then finally... I would have wandered into the frozen north if not for the reptiles keeping guard. Though unintentional, I only live and breathe today thanks to them. So, first off, a deer is not a reptile. Uh, a serpent would be a reptile. Uh, a giant stork is not a reptile. And a crow is not a reptile. So that really limits it there. It's gotta be uh, Andromalias, which is the, the serpent. I just wish this this game, it looks right up my alley. Let's see if I got this one right this time. <laughs> Last time I got him killed and I reloaded is I'm a dick. Ready? That could possibly be. Oh, yeah, this way I have to like envision that it's. Yeah, visualize on the creature back, banish it into the void. Let's see if it worked. Nope, he's dead. Fuck. God damn it. I don't understand. Where does the, does the deer fit in somewhere there? I'm trying to get past it as quickly as I can. I can reload it and try this again. <laughs> I want to save this guy. Unless I can't actually save him and I'm just wasting time, which is also very possible. Right, we go to Charles. He tells us every single one of those again, so that we have all this information here. What if he's a bad guy? Well, I mean, it's possible. I want to get this puzzle right, though. Being my journey in the east, the barrier between our worlds rendered useless by great glowing gates. Like, what makes sense out of great glowing gates? Uh, a giant deer, its mighty hooves would shatter the sky, leaving thunderstorms in its wake. Unless great glowing gates. Oh, but glowing, though, it's not like it's lightning. Uh, discovering punishing the evils of the spirit world. The serpent, yeah, has nothing to do with it. And then according to Charles, this represents Malthus. A giant stork took care of construction and seemed to really love metal. Gates, right? Is Am I losing my mind there? And then a crow likes to steal stuff, usually treasure. Uh, I did a thing with the soul flame and all that. So like, this, this so east, right? 
During my, began my journey in the east, the barrier between our worlds rendered useless by great glowing gates. Yes, yes, you're losing your mind. Thanks. So to me, it would have to be this. The giant stork that took care of construction and seemed to really love metal. And gates are, are metal, no. We put that there. Now let's go, which one is the one with the crow? My time in the southern waste was all too brief, chased by a crimson crow, emanating an unbearable heat I had to flee. So of course it's the crow that's the fire. And they mentioned that about Rom, a crow known to steal, always seeking treasure, its most famous heist was that of the underworld soul flame, permanently shrouding it in a fire that will never go out. So he, so Rom has to be the south, just here. That's Rom, go. Okay. And now, the north is the reptile. The only reptile we have is the serpent, which is Andromalias, a serpent that was tasked with discovering and punishing the evils of the spirit world. I would have wandered into the frozen north if not for the reptiles keeping guard. Though unintentional, I only live and breathe today thanks to them. Like, this, that has to be has to be the serpent. So the only thing we have left is west. And west says, To my west lay a city of great spires, staggeringly tall and blindingly white. How long did I stay? Even now I cannot say. So, great spires, big tall things, blindingly white. Could this be Furfur, a giant deer? Its mighty hooves would shatter the sky, leaving thunderstorms in its wake? Maybe, but I feel like I did this already. I feel like this is exactly what I did before. But I'm gonna do it again, just to make sure. Ah. <sighs> Oops. Like, I don't see any other choices here. Nothing else would make sense. I don't get it. Like, nothing else makes sense. I did the three that I definitely knew, and then the last one, even if I did want to double it up, I've done that already. I have to fucking go all the way through this again. Yeah, I think I'm going to try one more time. Swap by fleshy wall. What if he's a demon you're sending back? I mean, I get that, but so I'm gonna look at the achievements. Cause there's an achievement that's failed to save Charles, but only 36% of the players have achieved that. Excuse me, holy fuck. Because there's also history lesson, which is save Charles. So. I, I, I feel like it's, it's either or. So you don't have to necessarily save him. But like, I just, I want to get the puzzle right. Very strange. 
Skip it all, skip it all. Here's your next one. Oh, yeah, we already said that shit. Okay. I wonder if I can find a guide on this because I'm getting a little impatient. Tartarus Key Sigil Puzzle. I went through that, went through that. Gallery, I did the gallery, okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, all right, I'm gonna stop there. There's five fucking sigils, son of a bitch. <laughs> it's an eye or maybe a bow? Fuck. Okay, let's see what you got. The Sigil of Bi Bifrons, the Two-Faced Beast, a master of science and arts. They maintain all the gates and passages in the spirit world. I think you've got them all. God damn it, okay. So, I time the south, oh yeah, hold on. I began my journey in the east, the barrier between our worlds were reduced by great glowing gates. My friends, two-faced monster, a monster of science and arts, it maintains all the gates and passages in the world. Well, that's that one. And then um, we know that the north is the reptiles, which is this guy. And then the south has to be the crow. Rom. And then we'll look at the note for West one more time. To my West lay a city of great spire, staggeringly tall and blindly white. How long did I stay? Even now I cannot say. So that one has to be uh, Malthus. A giant stork took care of construction and seemed to really love metal. Like, yeah, it's... It's got to be that. The other choice is the thunderstorms, but they don't mention the thunderstorms or a giant deer or anything. They mention a stork. Well, they don't mention a stork either. They just mention the uh, great spire, staggeringly tall and blindingly white. So, I, I, it has to be Malthus. If it's not Malthus, then I guess it's I guess it's the deer, but. The fact that there was five sigils and I didn't know that, like, that's pretty fucking big. <laughs> Alright. Let's see if this does it. Come on, Alex. Visualize the banishment of this beast. Ah, this is this is it. Proof at last, at long last. Oh, thank God. <laughs> yes, yes, marvelous, simply marvelous. Booyah! I am so relieved that worked, even if I don't get how. My young friend, you are party to one of the greatest revelations of the modern era. By your hand, you've just revealed tangible proof of the supernatural. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I don't. I mean, I'm not ready to go that far. Okay. I can't, not for not for my peace of mind. Let's just go see Torres. She's uh, my partner for the night, I guess. She'll want to meet you. Okay. Hi. Alex, what happened? Are you hurt? I kept calling you and you didn't answer. I could hear these sounds. And, and who's this? I'm okay. I'm okay. Detective Torres, this is Charles. He's stuck here like us. Ah, uh, pleasure to meet you. And a detective? Oh my, this is exciting. Why is it that Charles is just bird? Yeah, it's a real treat for both of us. <laughs> Alex, what happened? Oh, you know, Charles is trapped in a writhing flesh wall. There are magical runes and symbols everywhere. The usual, for here anyway. Beg pardon, flesh wall? 
quite an incredible spectacle from beyond. Oh, it was a wonder detective. Who am I just talk with my therapist about boring things? So this will be exciting for her. <laughs> okay. I, okay, so let me process this. You encountered some sort of special effects rig. I assure you, detective, as the person uh, enrobed by the matter. Please don't use those words. Uh, uh, of course, pardon me. All I can tell you is it seemed very real. Alex very heroically banished it and freed me. She was quite marvelous. While I believe Alex could do something like that, magic monster circles don't exist. They just don't, okay? Right here. It had to have been, I don't know, a machine or, or something in the air that made you both hallucinate. Oh, I, I suppose that's a possibility. It just seemed so real, so, so... Sigh. Well, if nothing else, this place is certainly filled with exciting mysteries, isn't it? Oh yeah, real thrill, as your seat fun. Look, I need to keep searching this place. Boris has been going through all these books looking for any sort of clue or information. Ah, research. I love research. My time to shine. Perhaps you'd like a study buddy? We could put our heads together. Sure, study buddy. Okay, well, you two crazy kids have fun. Don't stay up past your bedtimes. I'll report back if I, find anyone, if I find anyone else. Call me if you need me. You take care, Alex, and thank you again for saving me. There it is. Save Charles has been unlocked. Well, as I said, I'm not calling you a liar, Mr. Warner. Oh, please, call me Charles. Or Chuck, if you like. I've never been a Chuck before. Charles. All I'm saying is I've been on a hell of a lot of cases. And has never, not once, turned out to be monsters. Demons, actually. Very different. Common mistake. But uh, more importantly, Miss Torres. Detective. Detective, sorry. But, well, I know you didn't see for yourself what Alex and I encountered, but surely... I think we're all under a lot of stress tonight, Charles. And I've already been doused with some sort of gas once. That's just the time we know of. Yes, there's definitely something happening in this place. As soon as we find the people who caused it, my fist is going to happen to their sternum. But no matter what anyone thinks they've seen, it's important that we stay focused on getting out of here alive. Not spook ourselves with stories. But, ugh, of course. I agree with you, Detective. You're right. That's the most important thing. And you have my full support, of course. Good. We're too banged up to go snooping around in this place ourselves. And Alex is going to need all the support she can get. Speaking of Alex, yes? Maybe this can help. I found it in one of the books. A key that top looks like a lion? Right. Try to keep an eye out for doors with lion motifs. All right. Let's do a quick save here. We'll go over the lounge now that we know we're safe. Okay, so now we have the lion key, so to speak. So let's go upstairs. And there's one right here. That's a peacock. I fucking lied. Are they on the map? No, just the locks. Oh, that one. I can't do that yet. Uh, that's Peacock. And there's a lion. Back stairwell? Interesting. What fuck was that? Oh, okay. You get your mileage out of it. Yeah, for sure. Map update. What was that noise? Reach vertically. Hope anything is possible. Focus, you can do this. Escape, always have a plan. Catalyst, start your chain reaction. Achieve, make something of your life. Trust, hard-earned, easily lost. Now, don't wait. Inspire, lead by example. Green, think big, start small. Move, find your truth. Manage to improve the animal motivationals. They want you to ignore the rest. Leave 
cleaning products. This house has been some deep cleaning. Oop. There's so many cleaning supplies. And I thought my grandma was a clean freak. Perhaps, though if they have it, bleach can be used more creatively. Creative? How? Combined with ammonia, bleach will release a toxic vapor called chlorum uh, chloramine. In fact, to tell you possibly earlier, I was choking on precisely that gas. You think that's creative? Huh, well, gotta love a multitasker. Fair enough. Their keypad. Biohazard bins. Oh, fill to the brim. I'm not digging around in those. But why are they so full? What have they been cleaning up and how often? Point. Rubber gloves and cleaning clothes. I don't want to... Cleaning cloths. I don't want to know what's been cleaned up. How heavy do you do the gloves? They're, uh, I'm going to say thicker than any kitchen gloves I've ever used, maybe. Hmm, doesn't like that sort of thing you use to work with acid, then. Excuse me? It's a good thing. It means we don't have to worry about acid as a potential threat. Probably. Wait, wait, wait. A potential threat? How exactly? Like, I would fall into a vat of acid? How long have you thought that could be a thing? Considering how elaborate some of these traps have been? Acid isn't a big leap from poisonous gas. And you didn't think to warn me that you thought that might be a possibility? I'm surprised you didn't consider it yourself, honestly. The point is just going by that supply clause that acid probably isn't on the table. Probably. Bro. You know what? I'm just going to keep moving on carefully. Alright, yeah, we already had that conversation. That's why it's kind of gray looking. Books. Look at the typical books, but they're all blank on the inside. Either someone who's big into journaling or they're just for appearances, but who's? More books. Okay, so those are not helpful. Why would someone buy so many copies of the same painting? Replacements or set dressing? All right, so management approved the animal motivationals. They want you to ignore the rest. So I think that's, I think that's an animal. That's an animal. That's an animal. That's an animal. That's not, that's not, that is, that is. Not. One, two, three, four, five, six. It kind of looks like it wants to be a zebra, but I can't tell. So how many things are not animals then? One, two, three, four, five. Well, if we don't count this, one, two, three, four. Yeah, it's five. We don't even count it. Shit. That four. Roll of electrical tape. Oh. Duh. Tape tape today, I think this'll hold. Now where does that go? Oh. Is he enough? There we go. Hey, I found a really heavy duty door hidden inside a locker. A hidden door, whatever's inside has got to be worth keeping safe. See a way to open it? 
There's a rotary lock, so like everything else, it's got to be a puzzle. And you're a proven expert at those. Get on it. Yay, Jesus. You're welcome. Diamonds, spade, heart, diamond, spade, heart, diamond, spade, heart, diamond. There's no club here. That's interesting. Then again, what is the purpose of that? Oh, I see. So there is five. We said there was five, not counting that, it kind of looks like, like a zebra could be here, maybe a hippo right there. Do we have the ones to ignore? The iron animals are one, two, three, four, five. Question is. Start your chain reaction. Okay, so that's a heart. Lead by example. Focus, you can do this. Reach vertically. Now, don't wait. Heart. Diamond. Heart, heart. Yeah, I don't think that was going to work either. <laughs> Fuck. Trying to maybe it's an alphabetical order, like A B C D E F G H I. Those are both hearts afterwards that would have gone by now. Yes, the animal stuff is supposed to be there. The non-animal stuff is what seems to really matter. Here's the way I see it, is that this one, there may be an animal there, it's hard to tell. We definitely have a heart, a diamond, heart, 
heart and a heart. And I've already done every combination of where that diamond can go with four different hearts. So something to miss here. And even this is also a heart. But all hearts have been pretty funny. So maybe we only do This would be number one, sheave. A would be a diamond. Let's see, so that's uh, D is dream, which is a spade. Art or escape. Oh, H would be diamonds. Another diamonds. Yep, and there's too many because I still trust at the end, and I can't do anything about that. So it's, yeah, so that note is basically saying like, hey, don't pay attention to the animal motivational ones. They want you to ignore, you know, ignore the other ones. Don't look at them. Here we are. Another head scratcher, that's for sure, everybody. <laughs> I may need to look up another uh, little tidbit of a looky looky in there. Yeah, this is big brain time. Is it? God. <laughs> Motivational puzzle. Thank you, Demonic. All right, so now they're trying to... All right, so I guess management's actually right here where it's like, oh, hey, like, only pay attention to the animal ones. I can't even tell if that's animal or not. But it's not alphabetical order, that's for sure. That's first. Then a heart. A diamond. And that's spade and diamond. All right, cool. We got it. 
I overthought it. Another door, this better be worth it. Son of a bitch. Now what is this? Three different colors. Oh, now we do the colors. Okay. But of which ones? Is it just the six? One, two, three, four, five. This is actually has nine things. It's just these nine right here. Because this is like off to the side and that's off to the side. We'll do that. Blue, double pink. Double yellow, pink. Pink, blue, yellow. Fuck yes, okay. Let's go. Oh, for fuck's sakes, another one. Managed to open the door? Yes, twice now, only to find another door. <laughs> Sound frustrated. Hell yeah, I'm frustrated. If I don't find a key out of this place, I'm gonna flip out. But I hope you find it. Not sure I could handle you flipping out, and I've seen a lot. Alright, now I gotta rotate some stuff. Oh. There we go. That's the symbol that like loads. Oh my god. Appointment card pickup. Taurus, you will not believe what was behind all those doors. A piece of paper. Taurus, hello? Huh? That's weird. Anything else here? Okay. We'll take a look at it. Appointment card for the clinic. It's already been signed. Put my card, the booking. Interesting. Wonder what that's for. Uh Hello? Yo, this is some Max Payne fucking nightmare shit. Torres? Go ahead. Where to go but through? Ah, fuck. Oh! What the? Closet? Heck is going on? Alex? Alex, can you hear me? Torres? I mean, worried there for a sec. Couldn't make radio contact. Something is seriously wrong. It sounds crazy, but one minute I'm standing in a closet. I turn around for just a moment and suddenly I'm in an infinite void. An infinite void? Look how it sounds, and I do not want to go back. It's got to be another trick. This man should just rigged with puzzles. Maybe. No, not this time. We've seen some weird shit. I mean, a flesh wall for crying out loud. This was real. We've got enough on our plate that says, if you say you saw it, fine, sure. The infinite void of space is just one issue of an ever-growing list. Yeah, okay, fine. Are we able to at least get anything from the closet? I did find an appointment card for the clinic. It was behind all the blast doors. You think that would be useful? I just went to hell and back. I'll find a way to make it work. I have a feeling... Yep. 
I said just because this is for appointments. Push it in. This is stupid. I refuse to be a party. There you go. Hello? Little save spot. Doug, help him. I'm old. Fancy socks feel weird. Fancy socks feel weird. Like dress socks? The body parts have to be fake, right? I believe they're fake. Hands and testes of this person. Preserved heads? Medical journals, most of them very old. So it mentions balancing the four humors. A lot of stuff about bile and phlegm. Probably not a good idea to rely on these for first aid. Not unless you're big on leeches. Oh, compression socks? I can imagine those are not very comfortable. Never actually seen one of those in person. Particularly in everything, kind of like a giant action figure. This wouldn't be a real skeleton, right? Oh, I see. Hmm. Interesting. Fuck. Are we serious right now with that shit? Fuck me. So now your model is missing its organs. It must be around here somewhere. Okay. We'll find him. Model lungs, let's go. Model liver. What do we have here? Fuck, went the wrong way. There we go. A moist than a rotisserie chicken. Hell yeah. We can help, but we'll see. Hopefully that works well, yeah. Got the heart, okay. It was missing the stomach. Visual pain scale, I think they mostly use these for kids. I hope no kids have ever seen this one. Locked. 
course it is. There it is. Oh, God. Where's the skeleton? Oh, let's get over here. Good fucking question. Place the brain in the jar. What did that do? Oh, God. Holy. What is it with this place and things popping up behind me? One freak show at a time. Brain first, then skeleton. Ugh. Fine, skeleton. Got it. Alright, here we go. Skeleton, skull together again. Now, hopefully, it starts following me around. Heavy motherfucking hand swings. I totally just missed that. What up, Heavy? How you doing, dude? Oh, it's time, baby. The heaviest raid that ever raided heavy. Heavy, heavy. Heavy raid heavy. So this was like... Bend forward, bend back. This is forward? I've got Dr. Pee in my mouth right now. Oh, nice. You can't just move me around like that, Jug. Yes, I can, Fish. How you doing, dude? It's from last night. I want to... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. God, I wish you would use me like that. I mean, we, I could. There it is. Fuck yeah. Um, Thanks, I guess. I'm not even going to question this. We are fucking destroying... Hello? Help me. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Get poison. N need antidote. Oh god. Oh no. Oh god. Torres? Torres? Alex, what's going on? There's, there's a woman here. She's been poisoned. I, I think she was trying to fix it, but she passed out. Poison? That's... God, there's some, something oozing out of her mouth and nose. What do I do? Alex, Alex, stop. 
Remember, everything in this godforsaken house is a puzzle. There's an answer. You can work it out. Right, yeah. Where are you? What do you see? I, I'm in some kind of nightmare surgery room. There's tools and equipment everywhere. Everything is covered in grime. It's disgusting. Okay, Alex, if she's poisoned, you're going to need an antidote. What? I'm not a scientist. I don't know anything about any of this. But you're going to figure out these rooms. Work with what you have. I'm sure all the information is there. But I remember you get everyone. Taurus, hello. Static. God damn it. Okay, Alex, you can do this. I've got to work fast. Okay, real quick. You want to doze? Dude, things are rough right now. My sister, do you wouldn't believe what happened to her, man? My sister, she done. It's wild. She done got bit, Chuck. My sister, Chuck, she done got bit by a copperhead. Bitch, I'm so sorry to hear that. Did you tell Heavy about it? I'm sure Heavy would be devastated. Not looking so good. I have to make the antidote. Maybe something I can use around here. Obviously this. All right, pick up some needles. Just separate different fluids with this, okay. Any beakers think I can mix the antidote here? Ready medication for different stuff. Looks like it's all years out of date. Okay, these look important. I'll grab the ones that have any of their contents left. Alpha Kappa Phi. Okay. Scapples, forceps, beakers, nothing useful here. Unless I plan on cutting her open, which I'm not. He wouldn't listen to you, fish? That's bullshit. Some friend he is, huh? There's a lot to read and I don't have a lot of time. What should I focus on? Dermatology is skin. So I would say arrhythmia. Heartbeats. But you regularly want to use the binder element kappa. She's wheezy, but otherwise the heart sounds okay. Fingers crossed it stays that way. All right, that's good to know. Let's look up dermatology then. Hey, skin rashes are a great sign of telling how a person is reacting. Red and rashy is something irrelevant, and almost green color is bad. The towel in it must be administered alongside a binding catalyst. John looking so good to make the antidote. Who's around here? Uh, I could definitely draw blood. That sounds realistic. First, I'll roll up her sleeve and then stab her. <laughs> okay, uh, that does not look right. There's some kind of rash. Okay, almost looks green. I'll take the time first of the blood. I'll keep the rash in mind, though. Draw blood. Okay, good. It was nauseous. They make it look, but this should be enough. All right, so dermatology was a yes. Tau element, okay.
centrifuge report. One, plasma. Two, leukocytes and platelets. Three, erythrocytes. Four, heavy element. Heavy element, that's not right at all. All right, we already read all that. Buy more books, I think. I don't think there are any more goddamn books. I don't know what the fucking chemicals are, though. That's the problem. The label has a bunch of elements and molecules I don't understand. Same with that. Of course, it's locked. These scraps, were they caught? Oh, scrapes that caused by the shelf? Maybe I should take another look, see if I can move it. Oh. Okay, here it goes. Nice job, guns. Whoa, did someone manage to break out? It's not like intentional, they just covered it up. What the fuck? Oh, oh god, no, what happened? They must have had the same poison trap. So they were trying to escape, but didn't make it. The note, scribbled note, okay. It's hard to read, but there's something about fucking up. Use the last of the blue chemical. There's a synthesizing engine and a syringe gun and it hasn't been used. If it was correct, why would they not take it? An antidote? I'll lose this though. This body looks like. No, I can't think about it right now. I'm seeing things. It's all written over itself. I can make out that they used the last of the chemical tau. Something about too many attempts. They were too late. I can barely understand. It looks like a variety of chemical combinations are crossed out. At the bottom, the alpha symbol is circled repeatedly. Alpha and Tau, it sounds like. Fuck, I can't get back out there. Uh, separate fluids? Yeah, separate the antidote, right? Kappa element and tau element. Right now I have the blue tau chemical. Shit, which one do I need again? Tau and Alpha, did they say? Double check. That's Tau, okay. It was Alpha, okay. So, we're gonna have Alpha.
And then where's Tau? There's Tau. No. In a dote? Question mark? All right. Maybe something I can use around here. Yeah. Possibly, I don't know what to check if it works. If I've mixed this right, should be fine in no time. If it's wrong, I can't be wrong. That's not an option. Check the antidote. Here we go. Fingers crossed, we've got this right. If I don't, I'd be shocked. There's only two things. Okay, okay, this is right. She should wake up, throw up, and be fine. Here we go. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. How did, how is that possibly a fuck up? How does that happen? They only named two things I needed. All right, we're gonna reload it. Horrible science. Failed to save Ruth. Whoops. Now we're going to confirm. She's not looking so good. It's going to be an adult. We're going to use the stethoscope on her. Let's see how your heart's doing. Quite normal. <laughs> All right, there's my needles. Roll up the sleeve, see the green. Look, blah, 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 okay. Separate the blood out. Plasma, leukocytes, and platelets, erythrocytes, and heavy element. Heavy element, that's not right at all. Rash is something irrelevant and almost green color is bad. Now it must be administered alongside a binding catalyst. Okay. On the shelves. Uh, repeat. Binder element kappa. Administered along say binding catalyst. Binding catalyst. Oops.
The binder element is Kappa. Antidote from original poison. Synthesize antidote from blood. Blood equals universal binder. Okay. Welcome back, B Swizz. Neighbors, ugh. Okay, so we're going here. We know we have to do this first. I take the answer that I found doesn't look like they had time to use it. We're gonna go ahead and break that apart and get some tau out of it. Who drives a van down a small village with blasting music to wake the dead practically and drives 25 80 miles an hour in a 30 mile per hour zone? Uh dickhead. It said there was also Kappa in here. I want to see if I can break it down. Doesn't need to go through the centrifuge. I don't think it'll split into anything. I select the blood. We can need at least one more element. Okay. And that's the tau. Yeah, alpha, because bottom of the alpha symbol is circled repeatedly. No. I find out where this asshole lives. I'm fixing to slash some tires. <laughs> right, let's try it. Come on. This works a lot better, I think. Survive. Yes. Oh, thank God.
I've never been so happy to see so much vomit. Uh, uh, oh, my stomach, my head. I don't know which is worse. Ha! Ah, you, you saved me. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. I'm so glad you're not dead. Just take it slow, okay? I've been through a lot, and oh, wow, my hands won't stop shaking. Okay, this will come as a shock to you, but you've been kidnapped, I know. You know? I couldn't move, couldn't speak, but I was aware. I woke up on this table, and a voice over the speakers told me, Ha, ah, it said there was only one way out. Told me what I had been dosed with. They got you new to use my blood as a binder, or that's uh that makes my skin crawl. Wait, how did you know what to do? Are you like a scientist? A doctor, actually. My name is Ruth. I'm really, really glad to meet you. Oh, I'm Alex. It's nice to meet you too. Um I sort of wish we weren't meeting, not here anyway. Right, Alex. Alex, what can you tell me about this place? Why are you here? Who did this? Oh boy. Some of some of that I think we can help with, but all we've got are questions too. E? Yeah, can you walk? You can lean on me if you want to. We should go. We have introductions to make. Can I get an opinion jug? I don't know, can you? <laughs> what do you need, man? Alex, you're back. Hey, yeah, this is Ruth. Hello? I knew you could pull it off. Hello, Ruth. I'm Torres. I've been catching up a bit, but it seems she was in the same situation as us. No memory of getting here. Woke up trapped in a, a surgical suite. Only she was poisoned. A pretty specific theme. Yeah, well, I'm a doctor, ER surgeon specifically. Or, well, I was. Was? Uh, well, huh, what the hell? It's not like you're a cop, right? Not anymore, ex-cop. Oh, well, I'm an ex-doctor. The hospital board and I had a disagreement. Oh? You know how many people I saw get turned away? Bankrupted because they couldn't afford care? A friend of mine didn't come in for help when they should have, and now they're gone. Wow. Board says we're not a charity. It says we can't treat people for free. They say a lot of things with their leather chairs and expensive cars. I don't think that's true, so I started helping some people from home. Just, you know, first aid, stitches, and the like. But people kept needing more help, and those people told other people, little kindness can grow like a wildfire. Eventually, I couldn't keep treating that many people out of my kitchen. Got myself some abandoned storage space. Got some basics from some sympathetic folks, and voila, little clinic that could. All for free? Damn right for free. Righteous, but illegal. I was always ready for the cops to come knocking. But this, this is a whole new level of crazy. This is evil. Yeah, feels like it, doesn't it? I don't get it, this basically makes you a hero. You helped people. Well, it turns out you're harder to kill than anyone thought at least. No, if you hadn't come along, I probably never would have woken up. Saved my life, Alex. Oh, um, it, it was nothing. Not saving your life. I mean, your life is worth everything. I mean, I didn't, uh... Like, I'm glad you're both okay, but we still need to get out of here. We can save the awkward bonding for later, or never. Things here are wrong. I mean, more than the kidnapping and stuff. I keep thinking I see things, hear things. We're all under a lot of stress, Alex. We're all jumping in shadows. Besides that gas they tried to, uh, to off me with, they might have drugged us, too. The other guy was physically knocked out. I'm guessing we were dosed with something. It's probably still in our systems. Who knows? Maybe they want us seeing things that aren't there. Maybe it's more fun for them. Freaks. I don't know. Maybe. All the more reason to get out of here as fast as we can. Yeah, okay. Let's keep at it. Elementary. Save Ruth. Would you feel it's worth it or acceptable to stream demos? Uh, yeah, I stream demos uh, every once in a while, actually. No key this time, Torres? What made you want to be a detective? We're trapped inside a mansion filled with elaborate death traps. Sick was watching us via surveillance cameras. And you want to chit chat? Look, I've been running all over the place. I could use a breather. Help take my mind off everything for a minute or two. Besides, I'm curious about you. Did you always know what you wanted to do? I'm having trouble picturing you as anything other than um, a very intense child. Hmm, well, not always know. But I guess I've always liked puzzling things out, chasing things down, and never been able to stand it. How some people get away with something that hurts other people. Sounds like a story. Not really. There was no big pivotal moment or anything. 
other than a general simmering resentment at the overall state of the world. Of course. There's a time when I thought maybe I'd work at the family bakery. I just didn't work. It just didn't work out. What happened? I just didn't have the patience for it. All that fid fiddly, careful work wasn't for me. And well, like you said, I've always been intense after the third time I made a kid cry. <laughs> Had a face for the fact that I just wasn't made for sugar and customer service. No problem, Beast Wiz. I got you. We get out of here. I have got to see your baby photos. Okay. And that is where we're going to leave it today. Ooh. What's going on over here? Okay. Got it, got it, got it. All right, so that was fun. I'm actually really liking this game. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's a lot of story where finding new people to save. Um, and uh, I think we made good progress, actually. I don't know how many people we have to save and how long it is to get out, but good progress. And I really only looked up what one thing because the sigil i needed was on the ceiling and i thought i already had all four when in reality it was actually five but uh pretty decent. i'm liking it we'll definitely be playing it again soon let's see i'm gonna go take a look see and see who is raiding I'm sorry, who's on and streaming that I can raid? Thank you, Twy. I appreciate it. I'll, I'll do my best. How about that? Okay. Who do we got? We've got uh, Habitual Kiwis playing Unheard. Nox is playing Dark and Darker. Ginger's playing Dark Souls 2. Uh, Kirby Boy's playing Baldur's Gate 3. Oh, you know what? You stream tomorrow? Uh, not tomorrow, no. I'll be back on Saturday, though. Saturday with more uh, Callisto, uh, Callisto Protocol. The best is all one could ask for. Thank you. Even if it's not good enough. <laughs> um... You know what? Let's let's read Kiwi. Saturday. Yeah. So I I I haven't I haven't had a chance to talk about that. By the way, Tree. Um, it's been a very eventful afternoon, early evening. But um, yeah, I'm gonna talk to Amanda tomorrow to see. Uh, so thank you, Tree, for the dun dun. <laughs> it make me remember. There is a potential that we will actually stream tomorrow night instead of Saturday. Or maybe I'll just take the smarter route and say we'll move to Sunday. Um, I will obviously update Discord and Twitter and everywhere else with that. So everyone will know. Um, but yeah. Uh, I think we're going to raid Kiwi because it's not often I get to raid Kiwi. And she's a dear friend. And I have advertisements. God damn it. Okay, I'll lurk you if you stream tomorrow while I stream. All right, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Let's see. Come on, do this thing. All right, while the ads are going, um, if you'd like to do me a big favor and join us on this raid, I would very much appreciate it. Um, at the top of all that blurb that just came out in chat, and I'll also put it down below, uh, that first line with our emotes you can use if you're a subscriber. Everybody else can use the one with the uh, red pickaxe that says right underneath it. Um, if you'd like to follow me on other social media platforms to stay up to date, uh, I have a YouTube channel. I had been posting shorts, it's been a minute 
Same with TikTok for that matter. But um, every single stream uh, that we have here, I upload unabridged uh, right onto YouTube itself. No fancy editing, nothing, just right there. Uh, so if you ever miss something or you wanna watch something from more than two months ago, because obviously Twitch only keeps stuff around for 60 days. Uh, excuse me. That would be where you want to go, is to watch the, uh, the, the VODs there on YouTube. Uh, Twitter or X or Y or Z, whatever. You find me there, I do make announcements there and sharing memes, talking about wrestling and music. Um, so it's just like my... Um, album reviews that I do. And uh, Discord's the home away from home for the Jug Mob. If you wanna hang out and we wanna stay up to date before anybody else at any other point in time, join the Discord. That we get a, into a lot of shenanigans there and it's, uh, it's a good time. We have a good time there. So uh, let's go ahead and get this raid fucking oppin'. There's Kiwi. And here goes the raid. Perfect. So thanks again, everybody. Uh, thanks again to Key Mailer for giving us the key to this game, the Tartarus key. We're really enjoying it. Uh, we're gonna be playing it again to finish up the story for sure. Really enjoying it. Um, and uh, next stream, which should be Saturday. Well, I, I should say, currently scheduled for Saturday could be moved up to tomorrow or back to Sunday. Uh, I will make an announcement on that tomorrow in Discord and Twitter. So make sure you follow me on one of those or both if you'd like. But with that said, that's gonna do it for me tonight. It's been awesome hanging with all of you again. Um, today was not a good day for me and just streaming and hanging out with the Jug Mob, just it, it really, it brings me up a little bit, just enough to not feel like shit, you know? Um, and sometimes more. And I think today with the, the good game, the good puzzle, it was like chill, but also I was on like the edge of my seat. It was just, it was what I needed. It's what I needed. So thank you all for being here and, and keeping me up and going. And don't forget, stay tuned. Jugtober announcement coming soon. See you guys later. Hang out with Kiwi to follow if you like the content. Goodbye.